Hello and welcome to a very special episode of the Bell Hops Tabletop. I am Mo Tuzno, the Tabletop Bell Hop, your cardboard concierge, and I'd like to welcome you to my game room on November 7th, 2020, the day we celebrate, I guess it's a celebration, I don't know, we take part in Extra Life, I want to call it like a holiday, like, hey, it's Extra Life, happy Extra Life, but really it's a charity about raising money for sick kids, so I don't know if that's really appropriate to be like, hey... I know David used to that whenever we go to the local events. He'd be like, welcome to Extra Life. And I always felt a little weird. But anyway, today we are taking part in Extra Life, which is a worldwide charity where gamers all over the world are playing games for 24 hours, some straight, some not, to raise money for the Children's Miracle Network Hospital. This is actually the eighth year we are taking part here in Windsor, Ontario. Uh, we have an Extra Life team that people are welcome to join. And uh, we're also individually raising money for this. So today I am joined by my wife, Deanna. And our first game of Extra Life this year is going to be Gloomhaven Jaws of the Lion. Normally, we live stream these games on Friday nights at 9 p.m. Eastern Time, New York, Toronto Time. And we decided this week, because we wanted to get to bed early last night and because we wanted to kick off Extra Life with a bang, we we're going to move our Gloomhaven stream to the first thing we play on Extra Life. So that's what we're doing today. So we are going to be playing this one. So the big thing that I want to point out is if you're on desktop, you can scroll down. There is a donate button. On mobile, if you turn your phone sideways, there's a little extensions button. You can find the Extra Life widget, and you can donate to the cause, which would be awesome. That is what we're here for. All proceeds we are raising is going to Sick Kids in Toronto, Ontario. Um, for the fact that we both have friends and family impacted there, we have friends who have went there yep. when they were... Uh, kids themselves and it's a it's a great cause it's it's also the closest children's miracle network hospital plus my podcast co-host who sadly couldn't be here today because of the covid crisis uh, his wife works there so we're uh raising money for sick kids so the biggest thing i would like everyone to do today is you know all the likes subscribe and everything else i would like you to hit that donate button in addition we are we should be by now gloomhaven experts and we are nowhere near because we make mistakes every stream so what I want people in the watching live to do today is if you spot us doing something wrong, please point it out. We always ask for that. We want to know if we mess something up. But for every time that happens, we're going to donate a buck to Extra Life. Maybe I'll make extra mistakes just to see if you catch them. No, I don't. <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good plan. Uh, so yeah, buck, buck per, per mess up. Um, for those of you watching this, because we're going to convert this to video on demand onto YouTube, Extra Life is a year-round charity. And you know what? We'll keep it open. If people point out stuff later... On YouTube, it's not, it's not like next year, but if you catch stuff within you the... You got like, until the end of, the, yeah. of 2020. Until the end of 2020. <laughs> if you catch any mistakes, put them in the comments on YouTube and same deal. We'll toss a buck towards Extra Life. We'll probably round up to the nearest five or something. Um, other than that, again, I am Mo Tuzano, the Tabletop Bellhop. You can find all our content at tabletopbellhop.com. Uh, for those of you on YouTube, there'll be a little eye up here you can click on that gives you links to all our stuff. We also have a Patreon, but today I don't want you to nope. support our Patreon. Support Extra Life. That's all we care about today. you have anything to add? I kind of talked a whole bunch there. So. No, that's it. I interjected. All right. So again, Deanna, Mo, we are about to play some Gloomhaven Jaws of the Lion. We are playing, I am a level 4 Void Warden, which is the human Void Warden in this game, who is mainly someone who supports other characters. Um, I make the enemies do things, and I make my compatriot here do things. Sometimes against their will. I am playing the Volrath Redguard. I'm trying to think of how to sum up my character. I'm going to do interesting things with shield today. There you Spiky go. Spiky shields. That's my plan. You have like these ranged sickle attack things. Where yeah. there are melee attacks that are ranged to thing. It, and a whole bunch of like move attack, move attack type stuff. Not a whole bunch. I have one I use quite frequently. Oh, okay. There's just one. Um... It's interesting because I have some attacks that are at a range but are considered melee attacks. Yeah, yeah. that's a unique thing. For that's this a character. unique thing. Plus, you do a lot with fire and sun, where I do a lot with ice and dark. Yep. All right. The other thing we are going to do for you folks here joining us live is we are going to let you decide or help decide which way we are going next. So, as of our last game, we actually unlocked three different ways to go. So, so far at this point in Jaws of the Lion, the biggest branching path has been two directions. And every time you picked one of the directions, the other direction got closed off. So you couldn't go back and do it. So that happened last week is, is we closed off one of the paths and it branched two ways. One of the ways is following the plot. So we went through the 
decrepit sewers? Defiled. Defiled sewers? Okay, the defiled sewers, which led to... I can't remember what they're called. The Vile Harvest. But the other thing that unlocked is there were a whole bunch of vermlings down in the sewer, and we could follow them to the Den of Thieves. So one of the options we have is Den of Thieves. The other one's Vile Harvest. But then when we got back to Gloomhaven, we were hanging out at the bar, and this Inox came over and offered us a job. And that was to find something missing... Misplaced goods. To find some misplaced goods. So what we decided, we made one executive decision ahead of time. Sorry, people. Is we are not going to complete continue the main plot. Especially for Extra Life. We're going to do a side quest today. So no matter what happens today, it's not going to ruin our overall game. Not that I think that would ever happen anyway. So we're doing side quests today. So we're doing one of the two. So Den of Thieves going after um, some Vermlings. And that's the only one, because we don't want to do the other one. No, uh, And then the other one's misplaced goods, which we have no idea. This Inox hired us. We don't even know if we should trust trusted them. Um, we decided to um, not even take payment up front, which I, if I remember gave us something. That was the option. And they ended up giving us money. Yeah, they gave us money. They, they did pay us up front. Whereas if we had asked to be paid up front, I don't know. I, we didn't look. <laughs> so what we're going to do is I have this cool thing called Heat Map installed on Zoom. Or on Twitch, sorry. And I'm going to put up both map pieces, and you're going to click on whichever one you want us to do on it. Please click, you know what, to be honest, click all you want, and we'll just see whichever one's brighter. Yep. Maybe someone's got better better mouse click skills. Crazy. Click crazy. Click <clears throat> crazy. I don't care. I just want to see one of these two light up. So here it goes. Yeah. Oh, there I we see. go. Look, I see heat. I, I don't see know heat. which one's on the left. Should it doesn't I seem it? to work on mobile. I see lots of heat to the, to the left hand yeah, side. Yeah, that's the right but one. It's my left. It's awesome. See, that's just a cool feature. It is a cool feature. But it doesn't seem to work on mobile. Well, it could just be because you have spinny wheel of doom. Yeah, now we have spinny wheel again. You have All right, no that's awesome. internet access. <laughs> you can keep that part of the video. Yay. All right, we are good. We are doing Huzzah. We are doing Den of Thieves. Let's get this Fighting lots of gloom havens. Up. Fighting lots of gloom havens. What did we decide? We decided 19 was Den of Thieves, right? Den of Thieves. All right, there we go. Look, even says All Den of Thieves the on the bottom. So we are headed to the Den of Thieves, which looks kind of like this. Which we will read the introduction. Any vermling nest within the city can be problematic. And the possibility that these vermlings may be consorting with these red-robed madmen or infected by their experiments, well... It's probably just to exterminate the lot of them. You move past the old rusted lever through the dugout tunnel into an older network of sewer passageways. You don't have to go far before you find the savage little creatures. They're fur matted with oozing growths. They scream and wave their crude weapons at you. This place needs to be destroyed. But maybe you can find more information on the cult as well. And there is additional info. The objectives are nests. Each one has level plus one times characters hit points. So four, no, three times two, six hit points each. So we should put six hit points on these. When a nest is destroyed, place a treasure tile in its hex. These treasure tiles have no reference number or reward. When four treasure tiles have been looted, the scenario is complete. So you have to destroy them and loot them. That's interesting. And that's it. No other special rules. Our goal is to destroy all nets and loot all treasure tiles, which makes more sense now that I know what the treasure tiles look like. Yes. So if there are no treasure tiles. They are separated into four different rooms, three different rooms. So that doesn't look so bad. Well, there's four rooms. We're in the first room. We're like in an exterior yeah, yeah. hallway kind of thing. So we do not have to kill the monsters. That's important. So we should ignore all the rats in the last room and just pound on the just thing if we can. The nest, right? Yeah, because all those rat monstrosities probably be a pain. Okay, we didn't have enough threes. Here are two battle goals oh, for sure. you. Sure, I could put threes instead, but yeah, okay. I thought just I, I was actually nicer. worried we wouldn't have enough ones, or else I would put ones on every. Yeah. All right. Sake. What do we got? That's weird. I've never seen that. Huh. Huh. Wow. Wow. I've never seen either of these. So here is one. This looks possible. But I don't do a lot of that, that first word there. 
And then this one, I'm like, man, that, that's really interesting. And I am really tempted to try that just to see if I can do it. So I think I'm going to go with that. You can probably start discussing yours or whatever. All right. Well, because there's lights, I, right? I have a strong preference here. <laughs> so we have, uh, I hope you guys can read this. I go. can never tell if it's crisp. I would prefer no, not no, to the, do that. The heat map's not working. Sorry, heat map's not on for this. Yeah, it's turned off so that it's so not So people on. can't click all over our Gloomhaven map while we're playing and make all these bright lights on our video. It's the way it works on the back end. They're different scenes. Um, so yeah, I don't want to do that because I have several of those that I like to do. And this, this seems easy. I hate to say it, but that seems easy. Curse myself. Okay. All right. Uh, do we want to go through our cards quick? Yeah, fine. I'll do it first. This is my least favorite part of the uh, stream, but... I figure people might want to know what we're using. Shield of the Desert. I'm actually bringing different stuff this time. Of course, though, I could not leave behind Twirly Stabs because that's one of my favorites. And I think you're better off holding it farther. We have Burn Away the Dark. Desert Night. Which is good because it infuses darkness for most character to play off of. So I haven't brought this one out in a while. This is Shield Spikes, and and I will be putting that on very soon. And it stays on for the entire entirety until I turn it off. Uh, we've got Warrior of the Sun, Barbaric Instincts, Swift Strength. Blinding Sickle, and Flaming Sickle. I did not bring the one that lets me attack, move, attack. All right. I'm All right. going to be like, where is your we, blade dance? We are doing Turn Out the Lights, Taunting Fate, Wicked Scratch, the card that will always be in my deck, Black Boon, Close to the Abyss, Gift of the Void, Resigned Frenzy, The Last Journey, Signs of the Void, Freeze the Soul, and Grasp of Doom. Alright, are we in the positions we want to be in? <laughs> I think so. I could back up. I don't know. You want to swap with me? It's not actually any... You're closer to this guy. That's the only That's fine. difference. No. Nope. I'm all for you being closer to the elite. And we have never fought Vermling Raiders before in this. So we have no idea what they're going to do, right? That's true. These guys are going to rush and attack melee, most likely. They do have a ranged. So... But they're super speedy. Right? They're 3-4. I have a feeling he might be ranged because he doesn't move fast. He's got a ton of hit points. Wow. Oh, wow. I was yeah. thinking the Vermling, at least they don't have too many hit points. No, no. The, the Raiders, the, thinking, an elite Raider has 14 hit points. I That's terrible. we take these out first because they're weak ugh. and then finish him off. You, yeah. Okay. I don't know. That's, well, you, you tapped these two, I think, when you said yes. that, which confused That's me. what I meant. That's not the Raider. These are both the... This is the Raider. Ah, uh, okay. He's not elite. He's yeah, not so. elite. Got it. Yep. I'm saying take out the weak Vermlings. They only have like five or less yep. hit points. Quickly, especially this guy. Like, we can take him out one hit. Oh, I was going to put my shield spikes on right away. That was my plan. But then I'm not doing much else with my turn. Well, I'm probably going to take out this guy. Or I could go for the elite. So, I'm thinking of just turning on my shield spikes and moving up. And then I will at least soak the damage. Hmm. Move up and put on shield, and then at least they'll get hit from that. It's not much, and then move on from there. Or, let's see. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. So you're moving up between both of them? I'm going to move up just two, right to there. Okay. 
turn to decide, do I give you an attack three, or do I make my own attack three? I will not be attacking. I will be I moving know, up and I putting on a shield. I can make you attack. Yes, I'm just clarifying. <clears throat> or I could give you shield. Which then you'd retaliate for two? How much would you retaliate for? If you also gave me shield, then I would have shield two and retaliate for two instead of one. No, that's only two. Two's not enough to kill either of them. It's equal to your shield value. Uh, I'm about to give myself shield one. If it would have been shield three, I think it would have been worth it. Yeah. Uh -huh. No dark infused. Hmm. Giving you an extra move doesn't really help. I don't have anything great to do on my bottom. You're going to move too far if I do that. I'm only moving two spaces. Yeah, but it's three away from me. Uh, if you prefer, I can move one space. Yeah, but that doesn't... Well, they'll move up, right? They'll move up, except we think the raider's probably... Um, I have ranged, a feeling... Yeah, but that won't matter. But it's not going to matter either way. Hmm. Ah, it's only one attack, though. If ice isn't fixed, that'd be more useful. Oh, that burns the card. I am. I might burn the card that gives you shield. <laughs> well, at the bottom, what it does is it gives curse every round at range two. Oh wow! And as long as I stay within range two of someone, right? And and yeah, with this layout, with this right? many. So the next five turns, am I going to be within range two of an enemy that'll put five curses in the deck instead of giving you a shield? Yeah, it seems like a good call. It's just funny because you're like, I don't know, this card kind of sucks. No, wait. Well, yeah, exactly. I'm looking at it. I'm like, well, it's just with everything else that's going on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. And it's going to go nice and quick. All right. We're going to try to take out the Elite and um, do that. Sounds good. I am set. Are you set? I am. I am. You are set. Okay. I'm going at 16. 50. 15? Yes. So you're just before me. All right. Okay. So let's see what these Vermilion got. I am never going to be able to figure out which one of these says Vermilion Raider and which one says Scout. The Raider is at 20. Raider is at 20. Oh, they're putting out traps. Oh, God there will be it. traps. Hmm. How about that? Oh, well. All right. And the Scout is at 92. Wow. And it is and ranged? It's no, it's not ranged. Oh, that's the scouts. Okay, this is the raider. Yep. All right. And he's poisoning. Oh, of course. We were talking about how there wouldn't be any poison because we had well, no vipers. He'll, he'll be dead. Oh, he yeah. won't be. Because we're not both attacking. <sighs> so I'm before you. So the first thing I do is I put out Signs of the Void. I'm using the bottom burden card right from the start. I'm going to have Tabo focusing this week. Come on. It's not usually I don't. There we go. Starting my next five turns, I'm going to perform Curse Range 2. So I have to make sure I end my turns within range two of something. That's gonna be my goal for the next few turns. And then from here, I have thought the bad guys move up. I'm gonna to try to finish him off with an attack four, range two, also curse and infuse dark. I am gonna shuffle this because I don't know if I have yet. Oh, he's so dead and, oh, I super infuse dark. That's disappointing. It's pitch you black You have in all here. that stuff. Oh, shoot. All right. Super infused dark. I need a coin. Oh, and now I'm not going to start my turn within range two of anyone either. That totally didn't work. I wasted this card. I should have moved up. I was thinking I was in range three of him, but I'm not. And I added a curse to their deck. That could have been better. Curse, curse with an M on it. That's mine. This is their... No, that's not their deck. So you're not doing anything to affect me, so I am going to move the full two movement when I go. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I just... Some stuff didn't get put away that should have got put away. And I don't even know where this belongs now. Somehow oh, we... You know what? Missed those. I want one of these with put points on it. Do you yep. have one? Yes, I do. Alright, we're stuck out here. I, I think I should have 16 hit points. So I think, thank you. Yes, I do. 
because I am at level four, and I will start with zero XP. Oh, this is my deck. Here, you have the monster okay. deck. Put a curse on it. I do indeed have the monster deck. And just darkness was infused? Yes. Okay. All right, I'm up next. I'm. Okay, they are going to move in, right? Yeah. So this guy is going to rush in. Oh, but if you move up, you won't shoot. Well, I could not move up. That's legit. Well, if he starts within range two, I'll put a curse in their deck. If he starts within range two. Right. On your turn. Mm -hmm. So you want him to scoot up so that he's within two of you. And if he were standing there, you'd he have would to be not move. Two of you. I would have to not move. And he would scoot up right next to me. That's fine. It doesn't affect me in any way. Just yeah. a little bit slower getting to the door. Who cares? Plus? Oh no, he's going to move he's, up. He's going to scoot up a bit because he's ranged. No, he's going to scoot up all the way. Range four. And he's making pit traps. He's going to make a pit trap right here. Yeah. Because this guy's going to move up. He's going to put a pit trap right there. Mm -hmm. Actually, it might go in the opposite order. He might put the pit trap. In the other spot, because this guy's going last. Oh, yeah, so he's going to put the pit trap there. Then this guy's going to rush here. Yeah. If you move up, he's going to put the pit trap here. That guy's going to move to here. So you can move up one. Okay. Right? Yep. That sounds right. So... Cause it, or you move up two, and he puts the pit trap here. And no, the then guy this guy won't And then move. he won't move, and you don't get no, any... here, and then he'll put the pit trap here. And then this guy will move to here and I'll be in two. There yeah. you go. Okay. Yes. So. Look at that. Teamwork. I am going to put out these shield spikes, which will stay in play for the remainder of the game. Or I do, at any time, I could choose to put them in my discard, but they would be burned. So I'm not, I'm not going to do that. So uh, each time after an adjacent enemy attacks you, that enemy suffers damage equal to your shield, shield value. So that will stay in play. And then... I'm going to do this move two, which is a jump, and gives me shield till the end of the turn, and I just scoot up one, which Mo already scooted me up. Sorry. <laughs> so I do have shield one on, and I have learned something from putting on those shield spikes, and that is it. Okay. This guy attacks you at plus zero. Miss, did you shuffle that? I did. I picked okay. it up and shuffled it. I All right. shocked that that ended up on top. Then he creates a trap. Which Strength would four. Be... Did it say? Damage three. Okay. A lot of these things are out right now. <laughs> Here. Tech wants to know when the Canadian merch store will be open. Thank you. Keep bothering me. Just keep bothering me. No, I mean it. Like, seriously, keep poking me. It's my fault. I gotta get it done. Alright, then the other one is gonna move. One, two. And then attack you at plus two. Wow. Friendly shouldn't be doing plus two. That's huge. Yeah, it's terrible. So this is gonna be five to start. Yeah, it's, it's terrible. Try it. Six. This guy take damage from your shield? Or is it only adjacent enemies? Adjacent. Oh. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll use my heater shield. So. He is doing. What was it? Six. Six. Minus two, so he'll be doing four, and he'll be taking two damage. Okay. And I'm also poisoned. Yep. Next round. Deplete the dark. I could heal you too, which would remove the poison. Mm -hmm. I could walk him into the trap. 
Holy instead. Fuck. Which would kill him. If you want me to do that, I can just walk him into the trap and you can go get the work on the raider. Yeah, okay. I or I could that. heal you and remove your poison. I can go work on the scary raider. You're going to walk him into the trap. Well, I'm going to attack him first. Is, are you going to go relatively quickly? Now? I don't know. I'm trying to figure out if I'm walking. If I'm walking, no, not at all. They'll probably go before me, which could mess all this up. Because if they're not. Okay. Well, it's just that it would clear me a path to the raider. One, two, three, four. Oh, true. If you walked him into the, sh into no, the trap like, first. No, like I'm super slow. That's the yeah. problem. And I didn't take that item. So, with what I have, I, do I even have anything at that range? No. No, I do not. Okay, Perhaps. I'm looking at alternatives. Well, attack. How can I go quick? Hmm. I'm really wishing I'd use my potion to take this back at the end of my turn, but I didn't. I can go fairly quick. Still not really quick. Because if I held back and you walked him into the trap and then I went, I would just walk down there and bang on that guy. Oh no, that's the walk. It's the top, I mean. see. That doesn't seem worth it. No, I don't think immobilizing the guy you want to slide around is helpful at all. Um, but, 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 hmm. I don't know. I could just try to kill him instead of walking in the trap. It just, I figure that's an auto kill. But I can't go quick. I, used I mean, I could attack that guy. That's next to me. I just figured it'd be better if you would get the other guys, but yeah. The problem is I want to go early enough to curse them because of my thing, too. Right? Mm. So I want to go before him you just for that sake. You want to go before him for that sake. So you want to go faster, so you're not putting him in the trap. Well, no, either way. The, the trap's super slow, but... Alright, I guess I'm going there. It's not very quick, but it's not totally slow. <laughs> I don't know. I have a pull one, but that's that wouldn't be pulling him closer to me. I can't get him into the trap. No. If you can pull the other guy, too. But it's a one. It's a range two. I can pull him one. Yeah. One, two, three. No, if I got him in the room. Probably, but not till late. So Tex asking if we're going to play on Board Game Arena. That's probably going to be the nighttime stuff. Because when we're done this, the kids are going to come. Well, it sounds weird. The kids are going to come over. But they're at my mother-in-law's for now. Just because didn't want them here overnight while we're... And, and get them away for while we're doing stuff later. So they're going to come play some games with us. And then at 7, Deanna's mom's coming over, and we're going to play the second scenario of Chronicles of Crime 1400. And we're going to live stream that. And then after that, who knows? And it's after that that we may We're going to play game. some games. Yeah. <laughs> we don't know. But so I have a feeling nighttime, like when Dee's taking a nap or something, I'll probably go on board Game Arena for a while. And I'll probably live stream that too with a window. We'll see. Yeah, I don't know, Mo. Well, don't go too quick. Don't go too quick. Try and go slowish. So. Does Draws the Line have any rules about talking about your cards? Or I'm is that sure like it a has the same. Rule? I'm sure it has the same. You can't say I'm gonna go exactly at eighty-seven. It might kind of because thing. it's supposed to be easier. I don't know. I mean, are you allowed to talk about that? In I don't think so. But right. you go ahead and check while I'm trying to I don't even know where that would be. Where would that be? Like communication. I can't, uh, that's a Gloomhaven roll, but I don't know if that's actually a... Mm. I don't know, I'm not seeing anything about communication or talking. Difficulty, dial. Focus, hand, heal. Initiative order, introduction. Key. Kill credit, which I guess matters for something. Hmm. I'm kind of surprised that's even mentioned. Perks, per 
persistent. Revealing a room. That still seems odd when there's no rooms. <coughs> Stand limits. No, I don't see anything in here, but the supplemental scenario book. Oh, there you go. If there's dotted line under the thing, that just means there's additional text. Like, see how there's a dotted line there? It's not actually touching. Oh, okay. It's not actually part of the map. We are not making it adjacent. I get it. Yeah, I don't know. I'd have to check the main rules to see, like, in the in the, in the tutorial, if it actually says, like, you are not allowed to talk. I have no idea. I don't want to cheat. No? So, oh, I know what I'm going to do, though. I'm ready whenever. Get some pictures. More than just the first room, maybe, this week. Go away. I'm going slow. You don't have to go slow, just... So, this goes away at the end of the round. That's how the timing on that works. It's not till Oh, now I'm getting flare from the sun. Correct. Oh, come on. That's not till my next turn. It's no, until the end of the round, yes. correct? Yes. Okay. Did you remember to account for your shield, too? I didn't think you did. Yeah, I did. Instead of taking six damage, I took four. Oh, yeah, but you also used your shield in your thing, so shouldn't you have only taken two? I, it was six damage. So you should have only taken three. I had a, a, a total of shield two. Oh, with your shield? Yes. That thing that gives you the extra damage doesn't actually give you any shields? No. Oh, okay. All right, 26. 87. Wow, that's really slow. Oh, good, 77. You didn't need a shuffle. Right. 87. I am after defending invaders. This is the one that matters. Good, 69. And we'll go there. We are all good as far as timing. Okay, at the start of my turn, I curse. There you go. Then, um, I don't even know what I want to do first. Well, let's do this because it gives me an XP. So I can't actually reach him. Yeah. Okay. So we are going to start with Resigned Frenzy, the bottom. Which I am going to move four, but I'm going to use the dark to make it a move three, and I get an attack two. Attack two plus one makes it attack three, and I re-infuse the dark. So I use the dark and re-infuse it with my thing, and he's dead. So I don't have to push him into the thing. And I clear to a path. Excellent. The bad part about that is... Now, I heal too. Your poison goes away. You get a bless. There is no bad thing. I like the bless. I actually used the wrong part of my cards. The move the bad guys was on the bottom. And, and I used still this worked. bottom, but it worked because I killed like the guy. It worked. We're good. That, that was fate. That was fate. And I gained an XP. All right. This guy's dead. Yeah, that was the one I killed. And if we do play anything on BGA, I have no idea. I don't know what we're going to play with the kids. I might break out Hogwarts Harry Potter House Cup. Something I can't yeah, remember what it's called. Which yet. we haven't even tried with the kids. Though I gotta admit, I don't know if the kids are going to get it. It's, it's To me, it seems like it might be a replacement for Lords of Waterdeep for a gateway area control game. Because it seems even seem simpler than... Or not area control. The 13 worker placement. will get it. The other one, who knows. It seems like a really gateway worker placement style game. Resource management. Which I don't know if the youngest will get that. But it's Potter. So that might be enough incentive. Right. Okay. So I'm just using this as a move. A generic move. And I'm going to go right there. Okay. Do you have boots if you want to reach them. I Reminding actually you. am going to be doing a ranged attack, so I do not want to be Good. adjacent to him. That's why I moved there. Um, so then I shall use my burning sickle. Is that clear? I can't tell from here. No, no I don't think anything you put up has been clear today. It's just not. The camera is not cooperating. Like it's still All not. Right. Well, it's an attack three, range two, and it's going to immobilize him, which doesn't matter. He probably wasn't going anywhere anyways. 
So I hit him for five. Nice. He's mobilized and light is infused. Uh, Sunshine. You have health. Right. She can be all the health. Take some of these ten cards. Yeah, no, the tens are almost useless. Because they get in the way, and then I'll be able to actually find the other ones. Alright. Maybe some QH. I'm not sure what you mean by QH. What am I thinking of for QH? Quidditch. I don't finish a turn. Um, um, but um, but um, so I did that. I infused the light. I attacked the guy. I did the damage. I did the moving. I learned nothing from that maneuver. Do I want to use my potion to get that card back now? For those of you watching on YouTube who are wondering who we're talking to, it's our chat room here on Twitch. We live stream our Gloomhaven games on Friday nights at 9 p.m. Eastern Time. New York, Toronto, currently Eastern Standard Time. Since the time just changed. It's my imaginary friend, Tech. Yes, imaginary friend. We talked to the Tech. <laughs> okay. You done? I'm done. Where'd you go at? What do you mean, where did I go? What time? At? What was your Oh, initiative? I went next. I yeah. Didn't... Oh, my goodness. That's a buck. Wow. Yeah, that's a buck. I'll just take those back. Like, that's... Put me back. Nobody's hit. I, I wow. just decided you were done. It was obviously <laughs> I'm my, my turn. I'm like, wait a minute. Here, hold on. Hold what was on. your initiative? Hold on. I don't think we don't need the chat room for that one. I think we caught that one ourselves. <laughs> wow. That's a dollar. Okay. What is your initiative? Like 80 something. 87. Yeah. Like I'm way, I'm, I wow. put myself in the right spot. But I oh, yeah. decided you were done. It was my turn to go. Um, Did I, did I take it all back properly? This card isn't here. Yeah, I don't know if we should reshuffle when that happens or just go with the fates. I think we go with the fates go and with let it fates. stay with what's there. The same thing's probably going to happen because all that's going to change is he's going to range attack you. He's going to range attack me Because this guy's the dead. The guy's dead. This guy is just going to do gonna a ranged range attack. attack. So he's going to move minus one. He doesn't need to move to reach you. He does a ranged attack right now at strength two. Wow, four. And wound. Ouch. Five because you're poison. Oh, no, I got rid of poison. You got rid of the poison. Wound. I don't know. I might be able to get rid of that next turn. So too. I'm going to take four. Do you have a shield now? No, not at the moment. Okay. I'm going to heal you six. Okay. I think that's what I'm doing next. And turn. then on my turn, because now, I'm your wounded, turn, I'm going to take you're one. You're going to take one. Yeah. And now you're going to do the same thing. Move two. And. I'm going to attack three, and it'll be an attack five, and... You shouldn't have put them away. I shouldn't have, but there you go. Once I had already picked it up before you said, hey, it's going to stay all the same, and he's mobilized, and light's infused. Okay. That wasn't terrible to back up. Yeah. I just Could've wanted to make sure the money is flowing. There you go. It's, it's all part of the plan. All right, so I think you need to heal six, eh? I, I sure do. Which, unfortunately, is going to put a bless in their deck, but hopefully we're going to offset that by them doing stuff. And I'm um, that's on my top, so I need to move up. So, I had a plan and evolved this. Do you want me to open the door? Like, no, I, I was actually thinking of being on the door. I'm, I'm thinking of opening the door. What's going to be in there? Oh, all kinds of stuff. Three rats... Do you and want two extra one movement? of the big vermlings. That's what's in there. Um, do I want two extra movement? It would happen on your turn, right? Because uh, I'm going to move two. I'll be in the doorway and I can hit him. See, the problem is I'm not using the black by healing you. I'm tempted to only heal you two. <sighs> no. I, guess. I don't know. Let me rethink about this for a second. If I'm there... I will be with it. Yeah, that's two of them. Okay. So. I could heal you eight. As long as you don't go too quick. But this, I'm going to be way back here. That's one I don't like. So you're going to be way ahead of me. But then you being healed eight should mean you can live for a little while, right? I should be able to. For, you know, a little while. Oh, as long as you don't go super quick. I'll heal you eight. And stay back. Don't go super quick. I should be able to handle that. 
So reminder, we are supporting Extra Life today. Scroll down on desktop to hit the donate button or on uh, mobile, turn your phone sideways and click the little puzzle piece to see our apps. Or just go to windsorextralife.com, W-I-N-D-S-O-R, Extra Life, E-X-T-R-A-L-I-F-E.com. Um, that is technically today on November 7th for our Twitch stream. But if you are watching this on YouTube, we are collecting donations until the end of the year. All set? All set. 13. 31. It's 70. Why are we slow? They do lots this of status guy's effects. not though. actually up here. There we go. That got better. For the moment. All right. I already basically described what I was going to do. So, first, I give you the gift of the void. Very void, miss. Heal two. Yeah, that removes your thing too. The and you heal. Comes off and, and you heal, heal. yes. Yeah. Okay. And then the big one is we decide to make fun of the fates. We taunt fate, which gives you a heal six, but I have to put a bless in the opponent's deck. But that makes me smarter. Boom, I feel better. So much better. Unfortunately, that has to get shuffled in. To the back of the deck. And I don't move. I didn't expect to play healer all game. It's almost all that time. <sighs> what do I have on the bottom here? Nah, nothing I really need to get back. Oh, you know what didn't happen? Oh, you didn't put a... Uh, yeah. You made sure that you were within... Two of the other guys. Two of not the this other guy, but not this one. See, I... Oh, no, and now I didn't move up. Next round's gonna... I wasted this card. Yeah. Next round, it's not even gonna. You should have put it into play later in the game because it's yeah. it's crowded. There's lots of guys, right? Yeah. Oh well. Oh well. That's not a real mistake. That's just a. I never used that card before. Give me a buck. I should have moved up, and then at least it would have had an effect, right? If I had moved into the door, like I'd said. Mm-hmm. Oh well. Lesson learned. Not very well. Wait a second. What? Just give me a second. I might do. I might not. I might use these cards in a different order yeah, than I was going to. That's what I did last turn. If I were to go there and then. Just be that one and that one would be a go to. That goes in three and four. Actually. Hmm. I feel like we need music. We need nope. royalty for music. Do, 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 do. Uh, okay, I'm going to stick with what I originally was going to do. So, first off, I'm going to scoot up. I'm going to use the light to be able to do the move portion of this one. So I move two, and I'm going to the doorway. Need the bang and all the new stuff. Here, I'll get that. Get the okay. minis out. Remember correctly what these are, guys, for this room. Don't like those guys. Yeah, I should have. Bang. You are going to get swarmed by uh, rat monstrosities. Lovely. So, the second Ooh, part they're of gonna that. They're going to muddle you. Yeah. And they're going at 34. 34. Oh, and you're going to be disarmed. So, at least the two together won't matter. Uh, so you're not attacking next round. So you could long rest next round. Huh. Well, unless you kill this guy. Oh no, they move three. He's going to reach you anyway. No. Oh no, because the rats are going to swarm you first. And it's not a ranged attack. So if you kill this guy, you won't be disarmed. All right, so well, it might be worth it. But Okay, well... To continue with the, the move action that I was doing, I'm going to attack one and wound on the fellow that I am adjacent to now. And it's a miss. Is he still wounded then? Yep. No. Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. Three, four, five. Oh, he's got tons of health. Yeah. And then I'm going to burn away the dark which will target all enemies within two hexes. 
So I will start with the fellow I am adjacent to. I will hit him for two. Yeah. And then I will target rat monstrosity number eight. And I will hit him for two. Oh, we screwed up. What do we do now? There's not enough spots. Oh, the rat monstrosity needs... And we probably need this also. We need the Vermling one, unfortunately. I thought the rat monstrosity was one monstrosity. Gotcha. Not monstrosities. Which these seem to be, there's not many of them. It should be in a six, but I don't really want to. Well, it's only one, right? There's only one of them out. All this is on one guy. Yeah. Which I need to split there's... them out. What numbers are they? Three and four. Yeah. Okay. So this should work. And we've been hitting three. Yeah. Sorry, bad planning at the start because I misunderstood the description of a monster. All right, rat monstrosity. Which number did you just hit for two? I think I started with number eight. Okay. With this guy. And now I'm going to hit the other one. For one. Number two. Okay. How many hit points those monstrosities have? A lot. Mm. Five for regulars, eight for elite, and when they blow up, they uh, do damage to everything adjacent to them. Wow. Yeah, they're nasty. And they have advantage all the time, the elite. Wow. Wow. This is going to go well. Yeah, and they're about to surround you. And they're about to surround me. I'm just wondering about at the end of my turn using my mana potion to get... Not my mana potion, my stamina potion to get one of these cards back. That dark's gone, isn't it? Or just at the end of the round it'll be gone? At the end of the round it'll be gone. Yikes. Hmm. Stamina potion to take back. I'm wondering if we should just ignore this guy. Well, we gotta take out the two nests in this room. We can't just... What is it you're doing? I'm taking back a card with my... It's the end of my turn okay. right now, and I'm using a Stamina Potion to take back one of these cards before my turn's over. That is what I'm doing. And I'm just trying to decide because I'm going to get disarmed and I won't be able to attack, but I could put on yes. this Shield 3, which is a burn card next turn, mm. and then it would do 3 damage to everyone that comes in and attacks me. So that's if I can even live idea. through this freaking round. That's what I was considering. Well, shield three means you should live through it. Yeah, but I won't turn it on until, like, it's not going on now. Oh, until next turn. Yeah. I understand. That is all she wrote. Okay, what's next? Next. Next, we have the rat monstrosities. Yep. Doing monstrous things. So, where do you want them? Here or here? I don't think it matters. Well, it makes it longer for this one to go around. Yeah, okay. Wait, where was he? Here? There. Yeah, they only move. He only moves one. Huh? Rat monstrosity move one for elite. That's interesting. Yeah. What it's is the big slow. chunk of text at the top for the elite? On death, all adjacent figures take two damage and he has advantage. And then these ones. That's number two. I can't see the numbers. So then this one's going to move up and attack you. For two. So two, and you're muddled. So you're not getting disarmed. Um, I could put on my chain armor to gain shield for the rest of the round. So I'd only take one. And then he'll take and one he'll back. And he'll take one back. So two takes another one. And I'm muddled? Yes. 
And then this one's going to move up and also attack you. This model? Yes. Um, so with my shield, that would be zero. Yep. But he'll still get hit for one yep. from my retaliating spikes. Okay. That's it for rat monstrosity. Okay, now we get the raiders. So these ones, oh, these are the ones with the disarm. Yeah, you're getting disarmed from this guy. Mm -hmm. So he goes first, attacks you at minus one, so he's only attacking for two. He's immobilized and burning, he takes a damage. Hold on. Five, Five and three is eight. No, I just need damage. Mm. If you have threes, but I think all the stupid threes are out. I think the threes are out on the traps. Let's see. Here's a three. Here's another three. That's not a good spot to put him. Yeah. Okay. So he takes one damage at his turn, then attacks you at two. So hit you only for one, but you have shield, shield right? So zero. And then he takes one. Yep. Which puts him at nine. It's so close to getting. Nine, he's not an elite, he's dead. I feel like that went right at least. Yes. You are disarmed though. I am disarmed. Yeah, I'm definitely not going to be near anyone. Disarmed and muddled. Okay. And the other one can't hit you, so won't move. Because there's nowhere, the there's nowhere there's he nowhere can move to go. adjacent to you, so he doesn't move. Okay. Whew. I need to go up in there, obviously. <sighs> and no, black, so, black is yeah. not infused, right? I could... I could do this. Wow, this is great. I'm not going to move, but I'm going to just put on all the shields, and when they hit me, they're going to But when they hurt. blow up, they're going to hurt you. Just I know, but I will have an I will have shield four. Okay. When I'm done. And. I mean, I can't attack them. I could yes, back up, but I'm like that's not gonna help really. So I think this is well. The only advantage move. is if you nah. when they blow up, how much damage do they do? So two. Just one for these, two for that. I can. So I can weather much. this. Yeah. So far, I mean, those may be my famous last words. Oh, I got a shuffle. That's why I had this like this because my miss came up last round. I'm gonna double check the monster deck does not need to be shuffled. Nobody else needs to be shuffled. Nope. Okay. I am ready. I know which cards I'm doing, but I'm just shuffling. So just yep. one sec. Uh, to me, I feel like this is the most interesting way to get it over being disarmed and muddled. There you go. Just put up spiky shields. Put up giant spiky shields. Sounds good. Yeah. So again, we are playing Shit. today for Extra Life, raising money for the Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. Head to WindsorExtraLife.com, join the team and play yourself. Make a donation or just share the page to your friends. And if you catch us making a mistake... We have to donate money out of our own pocket, so. Yes, I am going at 36. All right, I'm going at 10. Oh. Okay, they're healing themselves. That is the raider. Which is fine, he's not even is hurt. Going before you. That's perfectly fine. And the rat monstrosity. I can't, I can't reach it. Oh, they're over here. They're over there. Sorry, I was thinking we had to flip this. It's oh, is this that before is you? terrible. Yeah. Yeah. This is horrible for you, D. All right, hold on. I go first. Then we have the rat monstrosities. No good. You get your shield up because the rat monstrosities are hitting for a lot. Then it's you. I'm at thirty six, so I don't know. Yeah. And. I'm letting you figure that out. You're last, actually. At thirty six, I'm last. Wow. Yep. Here I was trying to go relatively quick. I could have used a slower card. No, not that one. Raiders first. Oop, there we go. So, me first. So, first. 
we will use Warrior of the Sun, which will put on shield one, and it will mobilize all adjacent enemies and infuse life. Right. So, all right, so I'm doing this shiny burn card, which will give me shield three and infuse all the good things. But light's already infused, but I get to infuse fire. It's a learning, it's a learning thing to use shield of the desert. So I have an equivalent of shield four, and at the end of the turn, this card will be burned. So when they attack me, I do four back. All right, I think you were in the middle of your turn. No, actually, I had finished my turn. I have put on all the shields. Okay. I have the equivalent of shield four. They are very shiny, and they are over here being shielding. Then who is next? Who is next would be the terrible Vermling Raiders. Okay. He's just going to sit there and heal himself three. Good job, Vermling Raider. Move plus one. Oh, but he still can't catch he me, so he's not moving. He still can't get you. Yeah. Okay. Good job. Now it's the, the, the mess. This is going to be terrible. So the Elite still can't reach you, so it doesn't move. Did I move him up? I shouldn't have. You did last turn. I shouldn't have. But he might have went first because he was the elite. So he. Oh, that's first, right. He so moved one sense. first. Yes, yeah, that's right. Because we looked and went. He's going to move one. To me. Okay, so now this one, number two, is going to attack you at minus one. So it's only an attack one, but it gets plus one because you have an adjacent ally. So it's a two. Minus one is one. And I have four shield. So nothing. And then that. Four shield does four damage to him. And that kills him. And when he explodes, when he explodes, take you take one, one damage, which is not you can't shield that type of damage. And then he also takes one. And then the elite also takes one. Oh, cool! They they hit everybody. For yes, good all adjacent nice. figures. I like that. Then number eight's going to attack you. Same thing. It doesn't have anyone else next to you though, so it's at one total. So zero. And then my shield hits it for four. Four plus all this. He explodes. You take so another one. Take one damage. And the elite takes another one. And he's dead. And we need two coins. And then it's me. Yep. Okay. I'm not doing a lot. I am going to grasp of doom just to move three. No, I'm sorry, it's oh. not you, it's the rat monstrosity. I That's who just went. Yeah, right. Now it is you. Yes. And you killed everything next to you, so my top half's wasted. You can attack something. Range three. Range three? Well then I no. think I'll like... Oh, okay. Never mind. No, nah, that was useless. Oh well. I really thought there'd be something still alive next to you. Yeah, I know. Um, thinking for a second here. One, two, three. And I didn't do it so I don't get to infuse the dark. Correct? Uh, I think that's how it works. Right, yeah. yeah. I wish I could. I planned on using that dark. Do you still need healing? I'm okay for now. I mean, I'm, I am hurt, but I still have a two-digit. I am going around. pretty slow. Um, the monster deck didn't have to be shuffled, eh? That's awfully. I will double check. It's a lot of cards. No shuffle. Okay, this does though. We badly... Well, no, another webcam's not going to help because your laptop won't be able to handle it. No, we need to actually get... We need the new PC computer and then we need the other webcam. There's a lot of if-then-else. I have no idea. Like, the webcam sometimes has focusing issues, but not like this. This is crazy. We've never had this much of a problem. Alright, I, I think I know what I'm doing. I'm not going very fast, so... That's, you ready? No. Give me a second, I'm going to do something here. Let's bring this back up. Let's move this over here. Let's do this. That's it? That's as far as it'll zoom? Are 
There we go. Just a little bit more zoomed in. I thought maybe that would help. I am ready with after that. I just wanted to try to. Okay, I'm at 38. 43. It's 74. Mm -hmm. That's the rat monstrosities down at 74. And the vermlings at 59. 59 is after you, correct? Yes. Okay. Hmm. Alrighty. Well, I'm just going to use this as a generic move. Two, except I'm going to use my leather boots to turn it into a move three, and I'm going to go one, two. Oh yeah, we gotta three, kill those things. Right up to there. I actually forgot about that. Yeah, right. I honestly, I feel like we might lose today. This is how I'm feeling right now. Um, so I'm going to attack two target all adjacent enemies, and I will use the sunshine that is infused right now to make it an attack three. What are you attacking? The rat or the... I will attack the rat first. Okay. Well, that's the only enemy. It's adjacent enemies, right? Can't I also... That's not an enemy. I thought we, we looked into this before, that those count as enemies. I don't think objectives count as enemies. I will double check. Because that's the whole reason I did it. The way I did it was to come up there and be able to hit both of them. Nothing there about them being enemies. Um, I would do the lip that I don't have my phone. A figure's enemy is another figure that is fighting on the opposite side of the battle. Yeah. Enemy does not reverse the... No, there's nothing here that Well, indicates... then how do you attack them? You attack. Because attacks don't say target an enemy. They just say attack. Says so attack three. Attack two. Target all adjacent enemies. I don't know. Objective hexes are surrounded by a yellow border on the scenario map. They cannot be moved through unless the movement is modified by jump. They are always important to the goal of the scenario and must either be destroyed or protected. Either way, they will have maximum hit point value defined by the special rules. This can be affected by damage just like any figure. But objectives are immune to all conditions and forced movement. When an objective's current hit point value drops to zero or less, it's destroyed, and a destruction token is placed in its hex. An objective hex containing a destructive token is considered empty and can be moved through normally. They are not obstacles. I don't know. I honestly don't know. I'm attacking right, the rat. Alright, go for it. Attack both. Doesn't say... I hit the rat for four. Four, five, six. It's not dead yet. Two more. And then on the nest... I hit it for four. Okay. That was learning. You know what else is it in this summons? This went away at the end of the last turn. And yet again. Wow. Yeah, that card was wasted badly. Who's next? Me? Yeah. And again, nothing's within two of me. I couldn't get close enough. You were in the door. So, I don't know. Oh, move two. I get this at the end of the round. You can move two. I don't know if you want to, but... I don't Siamese know. Hold and black on. Boom. What is he going to be doing? Move two. Attack ally plus within zero. Three range three. He's not moving. So, if I went up next to him, he would have disadvantage. He's moving. The he Vermling Raider no. is not moving. And he's going to do a range attack target. Oh, you know two. what? I'm going to go here instead. Sorry. Yeah, so you're not within three of yes. them? Yeah. So if I walked up next to him, he'd have disadvantage. Yep. That, I think, is Thank you for pointing plan. that out. All right, then I'm going to attack this rat. It's an attack three, the poisons. I don't get to do the bottom part because there's no ice infused. So attack three, plus one is four. He dies. That should be enough to kill him, right? But then explodes and hits me for two. Which is fine. That's the first time I've been hit the whole scenario. I am down to one card, so either I am long resting next turn. I am also down to one card, and we'll be doing some form of resting at the end of this round. 
Probably a short rest. Short? I'm just wondering why well, I have I all know. this stuff. The thing is, what I can do now is if I long rest, if I do this, this will mm -hmm. heal me one. And if I long rest, no, I don't even need the long rest then. No, the rat monstrosity is out for now. Hmm. The raider still needs to go. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to decide if I want to. I think I might long rest. I don't know. What do you think? I think I'm going to determine that short. based on how badly he, he hits. No, he's not going to hit me. Nah, getting back heal one. No, I'll short rest. Obviously my battle goal has nothing to do with resting. I'm still not going to be within two of an enemy. That was terrible. Alright, so this fellow once. is going to not move. I haven't finished my turn with this fellow. Oh, I'm sorry. You don't actually do the rest at the end of your turn. It's at the end of the round. Okay. Hence why I wondered why you were doing it now. Um, I was worried we were going to forget about these guys. Stupid sock ball. You cursed. Oh yes, yes that is, you right. cursed. Ha! Alright. You keeping track now? Oh yeah, it was just for extra life. You gotta put a buck in the jar, dude. Wait, did we say we were doing that cursing? I say we are. Alright. <laughs> um, da 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 da. What was I doing? Okay, so. This guy here is going to go. He's not moving. Yes, he's attacking you for Attack three. Attack zero. And he would attack two of us, but he can't get to you. Yes. So. Missed. Hey, it's There's missed. my curses. Um. Oh, but he had disadvantage, so he will pull two cards. Oh, and nice. That is there goes lovely. The bless. the bless gets out of the hey, deck. You, I don't know if you can shuffle those anymore. You keep putting all the I bonus cards on top. I can this, hand this to you, and you are welcome to shuffle. How many of these have we pulled here? I don't know. Okay. Um, so he's done. Everybody's done. So the resting. Now we determine long or short rest. Now I'm much in a long rest. It just did. I think I would prefer to take a short rest. Even though if I took a long rest, I would get back these. Yeah, you get bits. all that stuff back. That's why. Oh boy. Yeah. See, having those shields back and they do damage to the people. I might want them for the next room. That's kind of what I'm thinking. So. Well, we still gotta kill these things. We still have to take out the nests. We still have to. I don't. I would long rest for you. You get two health back too. It's a big decision. <laughs> this guy hasn't even been hurt yet, has he? Yeah, I never get my perks anyways. I'll long rest. Oh, I don't know what your perks are. Don't take a long rest? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Go for it then, but don't. Well, I think I'm really going to regret not being able to do the extra damage with these shields. That's the whole point of having the shield spikes yes. up. So. If you knew you were going to do that, that might not have been the best uh, battle rule. Oh, uh, the other one wasn't great either. Alright. The other one was use no potions. And I like my stamina potion. I could never use the mana potion. That would be okay. I don't know. I thought not taking a long rest would be easier, but then the shield thing. Yep. I'm going to long rest. Alright. Well, that's at the start of next round. Yep. Alright, I am going at 38. I am at the long rest down here. It's at 70 and people are here. That's great. We're like near the beginning. I told her that we'd be playing for well, three hours door. until at least two. That sounded like the side door. Well, maybe it's your mom's uh, delivery. Okay. So I am at 38. I am going to move to... You may move to... Mm. But he's going to chase you down, so I don't know if it matters. Do I want to move? Eh, if I move here, at least I'm adjacent to the nest. Okay. For a future Then I'm going to attack four. I'm going to try to take out the elite instead of the nest at this point. At range three, it's going to curse and infuse dark. Attack four. Four damage to the boss. Not boss, but... Got it. I got a three right here. If you four want. damage. A curse for their deck. Excellent. You want to shuffle it? Oh, it doesn't matter. It infuses Shoving dark. it in the middle. It infuses dark. 
then he this is dark. That's not actually is going to go and attack you at minus one and disarm, which will go away at the end of your turn during your long rest. That's yeah. kind of why I was like, all right, attack minus one. So two, you have a shield or anything? Not no. right now. So I take two. Next round. Now at the end of the round, I heal two. Why did I even? I should have just knocked it, That's... not knocked it off. And all of this stuff untaps, which is the important part. Can I get these cards back? Dark goes down one. And dark goes down one. And we still haven't drawn the shuffle. No. I could go open the next one. Oh, I got a ditch card. Um. So I think. Yeah, you could. You no, I think I'm gonna attack and loot. Assuming I'm gonna kill this thing. Attack and loot. Yeah, that's brilliant. Right? Okay. I think I'm going to attack and yep. loot. Yep, and, and I'm going to smack something with all adjacent enemies. Five of them. Like so. And how many hit points does that silly raider have left? Seven, eight, nine. Only two? Three. Four minus nine. Five. Five Right, left. I thought he had two threes there. I, I can't see. Five left. Five left is terrible. Or... Oh, I could add another curse to the deck. Okay. Am I better adding a curse to the deck? Because then I actually use up the dark. That's the only problem with me. I've made dark for a reason and I'm not going to use it. No, I'll hit him instead. And I'll change, save the attack loot for next turn. No, I've got to keep my loot card. That's what I'm getting out of. So I'm doing this one? Or is it? I do that. Our object is something to curse. It would make sense, but... Next All conditions. This curse a condition, I assume it's a condition. Hmm. Oh, when I open the door, there's going to be two rats blocking mm -hmm. it. That's interesting. Oy. Okay. Unless you use a jump. Well, Aren't we finishing the stuff in here first? My jump. I, I'm not opening it. I was just uh, okay. just thinking ahead. So, that's pretty much the... Alright, after this round, I think we're taking a coffee break. Because I need to go make more color. coffee, I think. Infuse light, and I think I want to infuse light and keep that for next round. So, what is this? That wouldn't be so bad. Okay, I'm good. I'm going slow though. Oh, round. 49. Hmm, not that slow. I'm at 31. He's at 30. Oh. Oh, he's healing. That's it. Yeah. Which kind of stinks. Yeah. So he goes first and heals three. Three. Yuck. Then you? Wow. Yeah, then me. Told you we should probably ignore these guys. The raiders. Oh, I have to hit the thing. Like... I know. I'm attacking the raider, but I'm just saying, I'm wondering if we should just skip the rest of these friendly raiders. They move so slow, they only move 2-3. Well, they do I think do we're just wasting attack. cards. Not always, though. Anyway, I'm hitting them. 
Yeah, well, it's I, I'm I'm next, and do you want me to ignore him and smack the nest instead? I'm just wondering if that might be a better strategy, or we're gonna run out of cards. Because there's gonna be room like surrounding the next one. Hmm. All right. Well, what the first thing I'm gonna do is uh, not to let the camp see move to and disarm one adjacent enemy. Okay. Oh, if I turn this into uh, yeah, light, yeah. is that bad? Yes. Okay, well that part's optional. I don't have to do it. Yes. Okay, because I'm like, and it. I can turn that into if light. If you had told me, I could have picked a different card. But... Yeah, no. Okay. So, he gets disarmed, which will affect next turn. Disarm token. There you go. And then... I ignore him and move there and do a ranged attack on that. Okay. So it's an attack three ranged attack. Boom. Five. So five. Oh, and light is already gonna be infused. Light is double extra infused. Mm -hmm. All right, me. I'm just double checking to make sure. I you wish I'd known you were disarming him. Yeah, well, I'm I changed up my turn. No I turned, changed up my turn when you pointed out we should probably ignore him. So. Yeah, unfortunately, it's wasted stuff. Ruined everything I planned to do. So I'm gonna attack him at range three and use up the dark. Okay. At two, I hit him for two. And then I stun him, but I curse myself. That's the part that's wasted. Mm. I cursed myself for no reason, because you didn't tell me you were going to do that. You could have not stunned him. Uh, it's, can I choose to not stun him? I don't know. What's the card? Like, how does it play It's out? a bottom. It's stun the enemy, and then if I use black, I don't get cursed. So, just don't do that. Just choose to not use it at all. And I'd have not, to use it as a move two, wouldn't I? You could choose to move and use it as a move two and move zero. I don't want to use it as a move two. Okay. I don't think I can choose to use it as this and not do either thing. Uh, no, no, you can't. But you could have You could have instead used it as a generic move. Yeah, I don't want to do that. That's fine. Someone actually likes to gain their perks. Yes. <sighs> da, 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 da. I did curse them too, though. Oh, okay. And I gained them. Oh, I did one more damage. Sorry, it's attack plus one with the blue, with the black. And he's stunned instead of disarmed. Which. Yeah. But now there's even more reason to just leave him in the room. But we didn't... Well, the difference is if a heal comes up, he won't even do that if he's That's stunned. true. So I guess that's slightly well, better. There, there is. Oh, and he has to be reshuffled to heal. Yeah. Just take that card out. Yeah, I like that. I like that plan. But you gotta pay at least five bucks to the cheat chair for that one. All right. All right. Now I'm gonna try to kill the thing and loot. Oh, except I don't have a single attack card left in my deck. Oi! Oh, this only has one hit point left, right? I'm gonna use stamina potion then. Oh shoot! That doesn't work. Can you move me? Yes, no. Possible no. Okay. Well, so um, legitimate ask, ask, because you do do that sometimes. I, um, because I could finish off and loot that thing in one turn if I only were adjacent to it. So... Are you going to stay back and just loot all these uh, nests? I no. can if you want. Yeah. I wonder if it specifically has to be a loot action. It 
Does it specifically mm-hmm. have to be a loot action, or could you just end your turn standing on it? It didn't say loot, did it? Just said collect. Mm. Loot all treasure tiles. I don't think you have to loot loot. <laughs> but it does say loot. Yeah. Just wondering. No, because that's still called end of turn looting. Is that what, so, yeah. when you pick up stuff? Okay. Yeah. Good, good. I just figured loot would be more useful because you can do both in one round, right? Yeah, and it's efficient, and you can get the coin next to you, too. It's it's a, it's a win-win. Okay. I am at 38. I'm at 16. You are at 38. I am at 16. And it would be attacking. This feather is going all the way down there. <laughs> Sorry. Stupid socks fell off. He doesn't mean the one on his feet. No. The chair socks that are supposed to make the chair quieter. All right, so... I am going to scoot up, and when I move up, it'll give me a shield, not that it matters. I'm going up to there. And then I'm going to do an attack two, which I'll use light and make it an attack three, targeting all adjacent enemies. That was actually good because I can slide it down. There we go. All right. So I do four damage to the raider. And then on the nest, huh, lovely, I waste my two times. He's one away. The nest is so dead. Okay, now we have to... I learned how to smack nests. <laughs> Replaced with a treasure tile. So that was a learning. Not that you can actually see that. I have shield till the end of the round. <sighs> now I can't decide. I can finish off the dude. And put another curse in their deck. Does he only have one hit point? Yes. Left? If he attacks me, he'll die because I have shield on. He's stunned. He, hit one. he won't attack me because he's stunned. But I could probably kill him off and put another stun string in the deck. You know what? But then the Don't loot even fails. touch him. Uh, on my loot, all any adjacent enemies suffer one damage and then oh, I perfect. loot. So he'll die on my turn. Alright, so we are going to start off with the last journey. I am attacking at four at range three to this nest right next to me. Uh, which is going to infuse dark. I have disadvantage because it's next to me. You know what? I might have failed. So I hit it for two. It only had two left. All right, good. I'm like, dang it. And that becomes a chest. I infuse dark. Do you? Got it. And then I loot one, and you are strengthened. Nice. Which probably won't matter. Won't matter. Good. So we have looted one chest. Now we need to put our debris here to show this is open, supposedly. That's what it tells you to do. Okay. Not that I think that matters. And that's it. I don't get XP or anything from either of those. Uh, this is going to get shuffled. I don't see anything else getting shuffled. Alright, uh, what are you doing? I am going to stay You're gonna where kill I him. am. Oh, sorry. He goes... His stun wears off. What I do with my top action doesn't matter. My bottom action will be loot and damage the adjacent enemy. So you're so not opening goes, the door? I can't move and also loot. Should I open the door? You can if you want, but there's going to be two giant rats in front of you when you do it. Yeah, I know. You might want to scoot up and get close to opening the door if you're not going to open the door. I don't know. I do know I can't move and also take this chest. So that's why I was like, the other option is I could just leave and you could handle this. But I actually thought I can kill him and loot all in one turn. It's not a bad go. Which, if you, I'm using this card. You know what? I'm, I'm going to go dive in and so I'll see how it goes. I don't know. Me dying would stink, though. <sighs> I do still have a shield. <laughs> I don't know. I could rush and open the door. I could open the door and back up. I, what I was thinking is I could move up, open the door, and attack right away. Uh-huh. And then give you an attack three on one of them. From which, where I am? Yeah. From four away? Yes. Okay. It's Do I have four. line of sight from there? Yes. Okay. But the problem is they have five and eight health. So an attack mm. four probably isn't going to do it. <laughs> Though it might, depending on how well you draw. Yeah, well, I have, I have no control over that. Plus, I'm going to hit one of them first. Oh, is it worth it? But then I'm going to get hit by everything in that damn room, and I don't have much help. <sighs> overall. Everything in that room, well, 
These guys probably won't do range damage to you. Probably won't. Probably won't. This but then guy even might. When the rats explode, I'm going to take three damage if mm -hmm. we kill both of them. That's going to make put me in near well, death. It... I don't know. I don't know if it's worth it or not. I think the rats are going to block up the door is almost a good thing. Because not too much is going to be able to get up to you all at once. That's what I'm thinking. And I'm also thinking if we go too slow at this or, point, we're going to run out of cards. That's what I was talking about in the chat room, but I, we were gone. I get up there and I do that card that's going to let me... Uh oh Did somebody cuss? I just see yeah, someone yelling ago. Oreo. You were there for it. Oh, I didn't realize that was already in the chat room. Well, the other thing I can do is I can move up and I can make them all attack each other. Remember that fun card? It's a burn. Oh, and it would and hit there's so many guys in row. that room. It wouldn't get this guy. Yeah, but... Are you? Do you have a jump? Like, can you get in there? No. So from here, you'd be able to get... everyone but him. Yeah. Okay. And good. have them all attack each other. I that guess. That does seem kind of awesome. Instead of you attacking four, hopefully the vermlings kill each other off. Mm. <sighs> yeah, I guess I do that. It's a burn. Oh, the problem is that's the move I was going to use. Shoot. Nope. Damn it, that's, that's not you can't use the top and the bottom of the same card. Oh. Well, I can, but I don't know. What are you doing? I haven't done it yet. Well, you're, the door's going to be open soon. Is it? Is there not any reason why I can't put these guys out? Because we might not open the door. Well, nothing's going to change. They're I guess. They're going to go in those spots. I guess. Yes, I could jump to the middle of all of them. But that just seems like a really no, bad idea. No, it's a bad idea. I don't have It's a bad health. idea. You <laughs> like... If I, if I jump to the middle of them. Well, I thought you were looting. Oh, I am. I, I'm thinking ahead, dude. No. Um, it's just, if I was here. Mm -hmm. Man, I don't know. Are you really hurt? Are you hurt at all? A teeny bit. Yeah, so it's not worth it. Yeah, okay. I pull. Oh. You can go to the door and do it. I guess it just it gets rid of my one of my low numbers and it gets rid of my biggest move, my my only attack on the bottom for the rest of the fight. <sighs> All right. So if instead you have me attack four, is that one not a burn? Yeah, no, that's not a burn. So do that instead. It's only attack three. It's not attack four. It's attack three. Yeah, okay. I'm ready. Yuck. Long intermission there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, alright. I'm going at 13. 20, How about you? 26. Okay. And the scout? Well, you're waiting to end up having to flip everything. 20. Oh, he's doing ranged. And he's going to create a trap. That's fine. I'm going before him. He won't be there. Oh, that's right. You said that. As long as I go. Are there still rats left? Fine. Yeah, everything's still left, right? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. We open that room. We'll have everybody. It'll be a party. All right. So this is really all that matters. I'm going to do the flaming sickle, where all adjacent enemies will suffer one damage. He turns into a coin. Which you may as well take. And then I loot one. So that's one of the battle rules. Mm. Kill and loot in one turn. Yeah. And fire is infused. This isn't actually here, is it? It better be. Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> I'm like, I, I planned so. my whole turn on um, it, so it better be. Um, ba -ba -ba -bum. So, that's that was not a learning. And then my top, uh, not that it matters, Warrior of the Sun, I have shield on. Yeah, uh, probably not. And light is infused. That part might be important. Boom. Okay. No enemies left in the room. We are halfway through with almost no cards left. Mm -hmm. So I am going to start with the bottom here, which is a move four, but I'm going to use the dark to make it a move three, and that gives me an attack two, because there's going to be stuff right there. At the end of my turn, I've got one strength in. All right, spawn them now. We did decide to spawn so, 
Should I try to take out the elite? What do you think I should do here? Or try to take out the weak one? Taking out the elite? I think the weak great. one's probably. Yeah, but I won't. I'm not going to do 8 damage in one hit. Oh, or, well, you could target the elite too. Mm -hmm. It's only enough. And when he blows up, he'll do 2 damage to the two adjacent. Well, yeah, top. but I was thinking if I kill them, they do 1 damage to him. Mm. Kind of goes both. Alright, I'll attack him. It is an attack 2. Ugh, I hit him for 1. That ain't gonna do it, dude. No. What number is that? I can't read that. He's number nine. Alright, then the big one is I poison him. I need a poison. I infuse dark, which isn't gonna matter. I use the dark. If you use it and then infuse it in the same turn, that works, right? At the end of the turn, it gets infused. If I remember correctly, I used it. Yeah. And at the end of the turn, it'll get yeah. re infused. It's, it's, yeah. And now one. Oh, I read the card wrong. I'm terrible. You used it up. Then no, it's infused and it's up here. I suck. What'd you do? I am terrible. One adjacent ally can attack range three. And it's range three, not range four. As I pointed out, the no, it's, it's four range away. four. Okay. One adjacent ally within range three. Uh -huh. No, it's it's a range three poison, and then one adjacent ally may perform. I messed that up. And okay. You probably could have moved up too. Uh, no, I couldn't move in it and also do the loot because the loot was Why am I action. poisoned? I'm not poisoned. It's poisoned. And you're up there. That was dumb. Wow. Yeah, it was bad. That's not good. Well, you knew I was going to be up there. Well, I know, but we didn't do the hitting. And yeah, now yeah, you're the up hitting. There. Like, well, you like, wouldn't we have killed it anyway. We didn't get the yes. advantage out of it, and now you're up there. Is... Uh, I have do, you, do you want to be healed for six? I assume not. I am taking a short rest. Then I'm going to short rest. Wow, I have very little cards now. Oh, As do I. This is not I don't good think this is looking good. I think this is looking. We are going to run out of cards. That's a lot of bad guys for flipping. <sighs> no, I gotta spend health. I can't afford to lose our loot card. Okay. Yeah, that's a lot of bad guys. <sighs> Damn it. So, sugar pops. Well, I can probably get out yeah, of the way. That's what I'm trying to figure out. <sighs> I need to go jump to the other door. How many rat miniatures do we have? <laughs> Do we have enough standees? Are there four more Oh, we rats? have enough. Yeah, yeah they're right here. They're you could technically off. jump to the other door if you want. Yeah, but to. I was thinking if it made it so less spawned. Oh, no. there's enough. There was enough for me to preset everyone, so no. Because that's an interesting rule in Gloomhaven. If yes. you don't have enough cardboard standees to spawn them, they simply do not spawn. Um, I don't think I want to burn a card at this point. I was thinking now I do the attack. All the the enemies attack each other, but that card already gone. Shoot, maybe I can burn it. Open. All right, if you want to, can you reach where I am? If, we swap if I spots? use my weathered boots, I can get into the spot you're in. Do we want to do that, and then I'll give you a melee attack? And you can give me a melee attack. And I'm gonna go. But like, you have really to go quick. first to get the heck well, out of there. I'm gonna go really quick, but you, if you remember how quick my really quick is. Uh, it's quicker than what I'm gonna do with this one. Then I gotta figure out what I'm doing with the top. Oh no! Because if I go first, I give you the attack now. This doesn't work. Ah uh, well. I won't. You can to... still get out of the way, and I can get up yeah. in there. That might still be the best answer. And I am going to do that, and then let's see if I was here. Mm. I would only get to I'm going to have to give up on my battle goal. I think that's my only option here. <sighs> and wound. That's not so bad. How many... How's, I, how are the rats looking? Oh, they're barely touched. So that... Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Or... I don't know, unless you can jump into the middle of all that. Enemies. Not... <sighs> I honestly don't know what we should do here. Okay. I can quest. move up to here and I can have shield on, which when they hit me, they would be sh I'd be shielded and they would get hit for one. Or I can move up to here and I can keep my jump for the next turn, because it's and I could I uh, I not right. be shielded, but I can and I can jump in there. But you have to get out of the way. I can't get out of the way. You can't get out of the way. That is a problem. Well, I can so what do I have up. that's ranged? I can't do it quickly. That's the problem. No, I can do it. It's just I can't do it quickly. I don't know how slow you want to go. So if you want to stay there for one turn, I can jump over you I'd next turn. I'd probably die if I stay here for that's, one turn. That was somewhat my concern. 
uh, from there, if I was standing behind you, I have some range to Did we attacks. even go with the bad guys? Last round? After we spawned them? No, we didn't. We didn't even draw a card. We need to do the rest of the round. We suck. Right? I didn't even draw a card for the rat monstrosities or the vermlings over there. The vermlings. Like, I may be dead already. <laughs> 29. And I gotta put him on the on the thing. And the rat monstrosities. I need their their Yeah, like we didn't even go for the bad guys. No, this will change everything. Yeah. Um Okay, so the Vermlings, oh of course they're doing ranged. I thought you said they didn't do ranged. Rat monstrosities, vermlings. No, no, that's not the right order. The vermlings are way before the rat monstrosities. Okay. I'm going to work my way up backwards. Okay, oh, sorry. Okay, vermling raider think? first, then vermling scout, then rat monstrosity. There. You're actually, it doesn't matter where you are. You've already gone. It was you going that triggered them. Yep. We got up. did you know we need to pay? I did. I, yeah. I wrote it down over there. Right. That's why I picked up the piece of paper. Oh, you you can't see that on the stream. No. I wrote it down. No, we are we are not doing well. Oh, this, that's a big this one. This scenario is terrible. <laughs> okay, everything's so gonna everything's going to go. So the raider is, is going to go this first. Isn't, that's from last round. You haven't even drawn a new card for this guy. No. Okay. Isn't that from previous? Yeah, you're right. Yep. Do you even have him in the initiative? I do. He's going first. Oh, no, because no, I, I had the wrong that's number. That's what I'm saying. You're right. Okay, so he now goes here. Okay, oh so we get the scouts first. Everyone's attacking ranged. I'm toast. They will move minus one. They would move up to two squares. What number's first? This guy here will go first. Doesn't have to move. I'm in range three. So attack. Okay. It's a miss. good. Then the other guy will move up one and attack me. Is that no damage? Nice. It's an attack. My, yeah, that's nothing. Well, that part is nice at least. That works. Then okay. who's next? Scouts are done. Now raider. it's the raider. He is. He is he doesn't have to plus move. zero. He doesn't need to move. So yeah, range attacks. four, attack minus one. So he's attacking for one. So he hits me for one. I'll use my shield. Not that I really... Okay. They're done. Rat monstrosity. The elite right. guy would go first. They're, it's just going to attack me. If it attacks, it takes one damage. But it's attacking at four. Yuck. So three. I may not go through this right here. Then he takes one damage. Okay, and then number four would go. Okay, same deal. For two. And then and that's it. He can't, can't reach. Yuck. Alright, now we can plan out this turn. Oh, hey. I am giving up on my battle goal. Because I, I can't stay I have here. I have given up on winning this scenario. <sighs> okay, so... You are going to back you up? You gave up on winning this forever. I did. Ah, uh, shh. God dang it. Are you Sorry staying Sorry about where you sounds are? and cables. No. I'd be dead if I'd stay away. That's what I thought. That's why I had to give up on my battle goal. So you're going to scoot out of there and you're going to try and go relatively quickly with that? Yep. Figure out. Okay. So I can move into the spot you were in. Where is that card? Did I lose that? Yep, shoot. The heal both of us card is gone. Alright, I don't see how we're going to pull this one off. 
Nor do I see how if we tried a second time to do it differently. Yeah, well, hmm. I don't know. I'll let you know in a minute. Right now I'm thinking about something else. Well, we should have ignored this guy, I think. but Because they move so slow. But I don't think that would have helped overall. So I want to be... Okay. Like, I'm thinking your best bet now is jump past everyone and pound on the stupid thing. Yeah, that'll be next round. uh, This round I get into the door. Next round I jump in. That's my plan. Hopefully those guys stay back because they're range and they need me a spot to jump into. So that's my turn for next turn. And that's my turn for next turn. And And now I think the kids are here. Which is great timing. We probably still have another hour to two left. I'm aware. Obviously the door's locked. Okay, so that's my next turn. I know that I'm going to use a mana potion with it. That's next turn. So right now, I'm going to... That monstrosity. Sorry. We are so close to not done. Okay. Okay, so I have an idea. No, it's fine. You can hang out here or whatever. So I'm doing that. And then... This is this turn. I'm going to... 13. I'm going at 31. Rats at 21. Boy. There's going to be a problem. You're not going to get there. Right. They're going to follow me out the roar. Yep. Okay. It's you. It's the rats. It's me. 50 for the Vermin Raider. 78 for the scout. I don't just let this stuff down. Cause... Yeah, they're gonna follow me out the door. Cause you did not go in between them, right? Nope. This is the other dead guy, right? This hit points. Yeah. Yeah, cause we haven't touched him. All right. So at thirteen, I use this bottom as a move to. Uh, it doesn't matter. I don't think. And then I attack four at range three, curse and infuse dark. I may as well hit the elite. I don't know. Sure. Because he's poisoned. So four, three, and four, five, see that's six out of eight. Damn it. Yeah. Spend another buck. We didn't give him advantage on his attack. And you just said damn it. Oh, damn, it's bad too. We're, if, we're going with even is, those. If heck is uh... <laughs> okay. Okay, so spend another buck because we didn't give him. He has advantage on all his attacks. On all attacks, the yes. elite guy. Oh, that's terrible. Okay. Uh, the non elites do not have. No. Them? Okay. All right, now it's them, right? It is the rat monstrosities. Yeah. The elite one will go first. Move plus one. I should have moved this You first. shouldn't have balled us up together, yeah. Oh. Here's where I die. Draw for the monstrosity. Two. Now it's only two. Still alive. Next round? He has advantage. That's right. Nah, good. I'm still alive. Next rat? Would be number four here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. They only move one. But they have plus oh, one. Move plus it's one. move plus one this turn on their card because yeah, they're swarming. One, two, three. <sighs> okay, we're equidistant. He attacks you because of my flea bitten shawl, which is why I move next to you. Excellent. Well, I That's can deal with that. Why I move next Ready? To you. Ready for him to attack me. Boop. Uh, two. 
So that's the reason I actually bunched us up. Yep. Is I've got that shawl. Then this rat, one, two, three. Hoi! Now it's totally jump past them and just ignore them. Yeah, right. except, yeah, everything's... You're next, right? Oh, boy. Well then, things I are different. I have one health left. Like, I don't even know. Yes, I... Like, I could jump past them, but I'd just die. Um... <laughs> yeah. La -dee -da -dee. Kill everything, then we'll be all good. Right. Oh, you know, if you kill any of them, I die and the game's over. Mm. You eh, can't kill any of them. Fine. I'll see what I can do. I can, That's kill, not I can good. kill this one. Yes. I'm like, oh, wait a minute. I probably should have sent right, a card. So, first. Oh, man. Okay. I don't even know. Move two, disarm, target one adjacent enemy. One, two. I'll disarm this fella. He's number four. four. Um, fire and no. That's all gone. This, this is what you infused on the beginning of your turn. I didn't. Have, yeah, I did. You're right. Oh, they should have a curse. That was part of why I did that. Shuffle that in. Okay. Those they should have had that when they attacked me. It's another buck. See how many mistakes we make in one game of Gloom Haven. I'm not gonna redraw. Uh, yeah. I screwed up. I screwed up big time. I got so distracted by that. I screwed up. I guess I disarmed him. I guess that helps. Because I was supposed to do this one. Maybe. I was supposed to do this one. Well, I'm supposed to be standing here and I'm not. Alright. <clears throat> Good gravy. Is that as bad as heck? I, I don't think so. I said good gravy. If you're counting that as a cuss, I'm done. I'll just start dropping F-bombs. Um, see, I, I changed my turn by doing the move disarm, and, it's, and the whole point was to use up the fire and the light that were there, but if I did that, I could target all enemies within two hexes, but if I kill those guys, they blow up and you die, so that's you not- You probably won't kill them, but yes. That's not great. Anyways, so instead I did that, and now I could either do a generic attack- wow. I can still discard cards and not die. I could do a generic but. attack, or I could put on a shield, plus all adjacent enemies suffer one damage. Mm -hmm. The elite is uh, two away from he's one away away. from one away. These guys would each suffer one damage, and I hurt. would have shield it's on. It's up to you. Uh, I would... Blurry again. Put... Oh, I guess it fixed itself. Good. Camera is not playing nicely today. Fine, or I could just smack one of them with an attack too. Well, hit number five in that way. Hopefully, it'll. Blow I will up hit, and hit number hit. five with a generic attack. For three. Okay. That's it. What's next? Oh, I did disarm the one fellow. We put that out. I yep. didn't learn anything. I've learned nothing. That's you at least gonna level up this. <laughs> I'm leveling up. That's about all I need to get about this. Yes, you get to keep that XP. We won't earn the bonus eight. Yeah. No, I'm not leveling up. Uh oh. Who's next? Who is next? <sighs> now it is the Vermling Raider. That would be this fella here. Yeah, he just sits there and does nothing. He's doing... He can't reach. Oh no, because he can move through his allies. He has a move too. So one, two, three. He's gonna focus on for me. Two, three, four, five to attack me, or we're one, two, distance. three, four, five, six to attack you. We're not. Oh, we're not. I am closer, but he only moves two. Okay. Right. Yep. No, he moves three. Because he's not elite. He oh, moves. he's not elite. And it's a move plus zero, so he's only okay. moving two. Yep. All right. Alright, now the scouts. 
Now they are going to focus on you because I have. They're not clothes. moving. Oh, yeah, that's you. I, they're not I, moving. Oh, they're and not they're moving. Doing range the range four, four. We're good. Yeah. Wow, that round went better than that pot of wood. <sighs> Use up the elements. Well, I'm going to heal myself too, and I don't even know. Do I still want to jump in there? Uh, that was my plan. I was going to jump in and smack everybody. I'm so dead. Again, I have no if, I if I kill these guys, they blow up and hurt you. <sighs> yeah, I, I don't know. Oh, no. See, I can, I can jump right here. Should I just kill myself? Like, <laughs> make them all attack each other, and then maybe I blow up with it, and then you finish it off? I don't even know. Yeah, right, because I'm, I'm going to finish this off. It'll be it'll be great. I might get through one more room. I'm going to move. Uh, I'm, I, I don't know. I'm going to run away, I guess. And attack things at range, and hope I stay alive. Okay, I'm going to try to move away from them, but I can't go very fast. Alright, I'm going at 16. 26. Oh, nine. Don't attack any monstrosities. If you attack a monstrosity, you take two damage. They're going first. But they're not attacking or anything. Yeah, but that happens before I go. Yes. It's in play. It does. 53 for the scouts, 85 for the raiders. Right then. So the rats. Don't attack any rats. They don't move because they're already next to everyone. That's it. That's the whole round for the rats. Explosive blisters. Right. So now I don't want to jump in there and attack everyone that's adjacent because I would be attacking the rats. No, oh, okay. I'm like, if you can jump to here. One, two, three. Yeah, well, I could go here, but then I'm only hitting one guy. It's. I didn't, do you have your boots? Could you get you one further? Yeah. So that's with the one, boots. One, two, that's with my boots. All I right. could go there instead. I don't know. Jump over him and attack this guy with the attack too. Mm hmm. Well, all right, here I go. I'll come to Kazi. Gonna do the move to jump shield thing. One, two. Do I want to use my boots to go the extra one? Because mm. I could just use that as a generic tag. Alright, so I have shield one on. And then I'm just going to sadly use this as a generic attack too. I'm not actually using my mana potion like I was planning on. And I will attack this fellow here for three. Okay. Yeah, that's it. You next. You next. I move four. Like I said I'm basically running away. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I want to be. One, oh, two, anytime I figure attacks monstrosity, yeah. even if you're not adjacent. Oh shoot! It doesn't say adjacent. Now, yeah, if I attack him, I die. Yeah. <sighs> Can I ask you something? From where you were, could you attack this guy, and then could you back up? I have attack range three. Okay. That sucks. I totally missed that. So you know what? I'm gonna use the bat the back one, two, three, and just move to move three to here. At least get a coin out of it. Well, I get a coin and I get an XP for moving. Yeah. Three instead of four. Use up the black. And you're right, I can't attack him. I was planning on it, it was gonna curse him to get me an XP. And, yeah. But you're right, it's not adjacent. That's terrible. That is terrible. And the stun goes away. Alright, now it's the Vermling Scout. So that's these guys. Well, so now they're gonna attack you. 
Number two. They move one if they have move to. Move minus but you're, two. You're all. So you're within range one. three. Oh, and you're about to get poisoned. Wow. Yeah, this was rough. Yeah. This one seems exceptionally hard for two players. <sighs> All right. Start an extra life on a fail. <laughs> That's yeah, what... excellent. There you go. Yes. There's my curses. There should be more of those in there. All right. So, and then number four here. Come on, another miss. Look at that. Excellent. That's why we curse the heck out of the bad guys. Okay. Heck count. Uh, I'll give it to you. Um. <laughs> I knew what I was saying. It wasn't scouts unintentional. Scouts are done. That's it. Now the raider. The raider pushes you one, which you can't because there's enemies. Then it attacks you at range, so it has disadvantage. It's an attack plus one, though, so it's attacking at three. Misses. There's Excellent. finally the shuffle. We found the shuffle card. Um, that couldn't I have had gone shield any on, better. So he got hit by he got he takes one damage for attacking me. That couldn't have really gone any better. Yeah, really. To be that honest, was, that was as good as it could be for how terrible everything is now. Now you can go pound on the stupid things. Because like there's nothing else we things. can do. You need to get in there and pound on those things. That's the only thing we can do. I'm just, I'm luring rats away now because they're going to go after you because of the flea blit and collar. So I don't know. I'm cleaning up the rear. What a terrible scenario. Side quest, right? That's why. I think they, yeah. they went, you know what? We're going to make the side quest hard. Because, jeez. Here, I'll shuffle this. I know what, yeah, taking a short rest when I don't have to seems like a bad plan. You so, have this plan? Uh, I could long rest. It would give me back my uh, amulet of life. I if you want an you element, I can infuse it for you. But if I do these two... But I have to go before you for that. Uh, no, nothing would, about that would help. These two cards are both incredibly slow. All the bad guys are going to go before me. Well, or I don't take die. a short rest. That's your call. Oh, boy. I think I'm gonna do the short rest. Crazy. I'm gonna stun a rat. This is bomb. That's that's my plan. Although I really should start healing myself. That's probably more important. <sighs> okay, so then oh, I'm gonna heal. Man, I need a, I need a FAQ. Because it's the close. This this rat's going to come after me. Unless you make a gap. Shoot, I'm still slow. Don't. Okay, hold on. Where's the other one? Is this one faster? No. Good gravy. I could. I'm gonna not be very fast, I guess. That's terrible. And then they're gonna go after you. Only one. Yeah. Well, I guess. I'm going to use my mana potion to give myself a, a, a thing. Okay. Probably on my turn. Alright, I'm going at 38. 36. See, you're faster than me. It's not a good sign. Monstrosity at 21. Damn it. <sighs> I'm going to be toast before they get to go. I was really hoping they wouldn't be quick. They're at 36. If they're tied with me, do I go first? Yes. You need to flip the last I know, monster. I know, but I'm just, that's the raider. I gotta be careful, because raider and scout looks similar. Sure I just figured you needed that number before you. 53. There we go. The monster deck you shuffled. Yes. Okay. Let's go first. Yeah. So the elites can attack you for three with advantage. 
No, two. Three. Three with advantage. So four. If you put shield on, you'll hit him back for one, which puts him at seven. No, wait. no I'm, I'm doing two shield. There, he dies in retaliation then, which is awesome. Okay, so he was going to hit me for four. No, that is fantastic, because then the other two. rat's going to come up and lose this to you. And he's going to blow up and hit me. You take two. Also his rat four pals. takes two. And you know what? Rat five also dies. You take another one damage. I take another one damage, and then his Rat four takes another, takes another one. Yeah, damage. Rat four's down to one. Wow, that worked really well. Okay, yay for <laughs> spiky shields. Yes, that worked really well. Nice job. Um, are the rats done? No, only the elite. No, rat the is four gone. has to go, but it'll go after you, which yeah. is awesome. And then if you still have shield, I do. I have shield too. No, shield only works oh, on sorry. one attack. No, this this one's done. Sorry, I just have shield. So this one. is going to kill it. Because it's only got one health left. But it is still attacking you at one. No. Yeah. Because you still have an enemy next to it. So two. So it doesn't attack two. It doesn't attack two. Minus you have one, one shield, shield. And then it blows up and dies and does one damage and to you. And it does one damage to me. Wow. I am looking rough, i got to tell you. Yeah, but still, look at this room now. Uh, it got better, but I'm not in good shape. I have no way to help you. Wow, I was not expecting that room to get cleared. Okay. I think I'm next. Yes, it is. It is you next. I don't know. That totally changes what I was going to do. I guess I just moved three. One, two, three. I oh, I would have picked this up last round. Um, so I'm using this. Move three. And then, um, well, how hurt it? Do you want to take two damage? Uh, no. If I took two damage, I'd die. Alright, well, I poison I poisoned something within range three. So I'm using Gift of the Void, but you're not going to use the an adjacent ally. Oh, I'm not adjacent to you again. You're anyway. not adjacent anyways. So nice I try. still poison Tim, I guess. Which he's at... Oh, that's right. They have ridiculous hit points. Mm -hmm. He's at four. That's it for me. Oh, well, you know what? It's go big or go home time, because... Playing cautiously at this point is not going to pay off. You don't have any heal cards, though. <sighs> nope. Not, well, not out of the two cards I've already yeah. picked to play this turn. Yeah. Um, so, things changed. So, I'm using, I'm going to use this just as a generic move. I'm going to move two to right here. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. okay. My heal cards only range two. <laughs> um... Okay. I use my mana potion to infuse sunshine. Then I'm going to target all adjacent enemies with an attack three. Alright. Oh, shoot. They're not all three of them are adjacent. No, it's only two. It's not quite as good as I thought it was. Do I not want to run up there? I could stay back where I was. Well, just if you stay back, I can heal you. That's uh, all. And maybe these guys won't be able to hit me, but they probably will. I don't know. If I stayed back here... The problem is my heals are... It's really quick. I'll probably heal you before they go. Or do they still have to go this round? They still have to go this yeah. round. I don't know. All Your these, call. all the roamlings still have to go. And I can see what they're going to do. Move zero attack. They're not. They're not. They're going to stay back there. If I'm not adjacent to them, they won't even attack me. They're doing Why? nothing special. What are you talking about? The scouts, they're not doing uh, the move zero. Oh no, because they still move. Yeah, I'm like, what are you talking about? They still scoot up. They're going to move up three. No matter, unless you run out of the room, they're going to reach you. Well, only one will be able to reach me. Whereas, well, know, yeah, because I'm in the doorway. They'll be in the doorway. Whereas this way two can reach me. If I don't move, if I stay here. Well, if you stay there, I can heal you next round. Eight. Which I'm going to need. If I even live through this round. And well, you can discard cards if nothing yes. else. And... The other guy. So, is yeah, doing I need the short rest, but that's determined at the end of the round. Attack one range. He's doing a range attack and he's not. Oh, I might not be able to heal you eight because you know what? If, um. Oh, you know what? I'm doing this. I'm staying here and doing this. This is better. Okay, good. It I'm wasn't. not going to use my mana potion, though. I'll All right. Save that. That's I will fine. not use the light. Okay, so. Yeah. 
so I'll just do an attack to the targets all adjacent enemies. Which he's the only adjacent enemy. It's an attack two on him. Yep. Three, I'm for four, three. four. Four plus four is eight. Oh, he's got one left. Oh, just wait for it. You're going to like this. Alright. I learned by doing that. That was a learning experience because I did it in the right order. I feel really good about myself right now. All adjacent enemies suffer one damage. Oh, nice. And then I loot. Hey, you actually got money. And I get all this his... shiny money plus the one that this guy's going to drop. Wow. That's, Boom. again, surprisingly good turn. And I infuse sunshine. Okay. We are done with Vermling Raiders. Right. The Raiders not going to go, but the scout still has to take its turn. But you can get rid of the other Raider. Oh, they're not, they're not coming up anymore. That's yes, true. there are no I more raiders. That. Okay. And well, scouts are pretty weak. Okay. We, we have a glimmer of so, hope. So, the scouts are going to scoot up. Well, they... Okay. Yeah, and Number you said two both weren't going to hit you. You were wrong about that. I was that, wrong but... about that. Okay, so he comes up here. You have the cards. Yeah, no, I'm thinking... Uh, that was, I turned this on from the, so I still have the shield one from when the rats attacked me earlier. This the entire this turn? Round. Yes. Wait a minute. For the rest of the round. You gain shield one for the rest of wow. the round. Wow. Okay. So I still have that. It's impressive. Yes. I'm like, I'm double checking that before they attack me. So this guy here scooted yeah, up and two. now he's doing an attack plus zero. So three. three. Ouch. Minus one for the shield. He, he would takes... hit me for two. I would die, so I have to oh, throw away man. a card. Wow. Um, he takes one because of my shield. Yep. yep. Oh boy, which one am I going to This is today? too tight. Too tight. You know what I could have done? I hadn't thought of that for Shans. Not even Shansay. I could put the third camera in the top corner mm -hmm. where my picture would cover it up. But you'd still get the blinding light unless maybe I could crop out the bottom of it or something. This guy's going to move in, and he's going to attack. Yep. Oh, another card gone? Wow. Another card. He takes wow. one damage. Oh, it was looking better for a few seconds. For, there was a glimmer of hope. There was a glimmer of hope there. There was a glimmer of hope. Yeah. I See, we're up a few more viewers feel right no, now. No glimmers right now. No glimmers. So thank you for joining us here on Twitch tonight. We normally stream Friday nights at 9 p.m. Eastern. Our Gloomhaven game, excuse me. We also record a podcast on Wednesday nights at 9 o'clock. But the big thing that's happening today is today is Extra Life. This is a worldwide gamer charity that's going on. We are planning on gaming until 11 a.m. tomorrow. This is our first game of our stream. If you scroll down, if you're on desktop, you can see a widget to donate. Plus, if you're on mobile, you have to turn your phone sideways. A little button with a jigsaw puzzle will show up and you can find the Extra Life widget there. Or you can go to windsorextralife.com and find a spot to donate there. Plus, if you really want, you can join our team and start fundraising yourself. And technically, that goes until the end of the year. Yes. So if you are watching on YouTube, you probably heard us a few, say this a few times yep. now. You can do the same. We are still accepting donations until December 31st. And I think if you donate at least 10 bucks, you get a charity receipt directly from the hospital. The end. The end. Uh, end of promotion. End I'm of healing promotion. you twice. I sure hope so. I uh, have to take a short rest or a long that. rest, one or the other. I think a long rest at this point would be a bad idea. Um, Mo, I'm, I'm. Look at this. We're we're not making it. Nah, I don't think so. There's no way. You have no cards left. I have no cards left after having the Should I bother two healing you then? Last turn. Right. If I, I mean, I can long rest. That actually prolongs things a bit, but they're just gonna kill me. If I short rest and get a card back so that I can take a turn, it's still going to be my last turn of the game. So there's no point in so doing this. So there's there? literally no way we can win this. Oh, I could finish it off. Come oh, on. you're going to finish it off. Cool. So with, I with should four go rats in here? and take out as many of them yeah, as possible. With four rats in there, it's very unlikely. So here's my short rest. It's very unlikely. <laughs> Mo's got this. We're cool. Yeah. I could have you totally go out and do an attack three. Um, okay. It's good. Uh, I can, I can, I can at least hit them both, and I'll have shield. It's the best possible turn I could have for my last turn. All right, sure. I'm going at 16. 26. 
So let's see. That's this is me, the important one. The new, the oh, there's no. Oh no. There are no rat monstrosities right now. Forty. Good. Forty. Good. 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 We might the kill both of these. Okay. Let's can go back over there for now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lead all the rats all the way back here and then jump over them and just. That would be brilliant. <laughs> I don't think I have enough cards. Um, that would be brilliant. I fully, I fully you... support that maneuver. So, okay. I am going to do twirly stubs. I will use the light that I infused last round. Get an XP out of it too. I will target all adjacent enemies with an attack three. I will not use the yeah, monster deck. Yeah, don't use deck. their deck. So on number two. Yep. It's minus one. I only do two damage. He dies. He doesn't blow up or anything, nope. so that's nice. And? And on the other fellow. Go. He does. Then I have a move to. Oh, sorry. I have a move to jump shield. And I'll move here so that I end my turn on a coin. Alright. And I have shield on, not that it matters, unless you somehow open the door and all the rats pour in. In which case I have shield. Wow, that didn't play out as I thought it would. So this is useless, because, um, yeah. So we're going to move four. Let's say run as far as you can. One, two, three, four. You know, it'll only move three. Because why not? Because next turn it's going to be a move two to attack it anyway. And then my top is useless. And then it's the next turn. So, what are you doing now? Uh, I have two cards in my discard pile, so I'm done. You long rest. Oh, I long rest. That's right. That'll keep me around yep. for another turn. You're around for another turn. I don't think I actually gave myself the XP that's from that learning experience. Okay. I'm ready. You ready? <sighs> Uh, yeah, I'm resting. Yes, okay, it's only bad guys here. So at no 13, I heal myself 6. And I put a curse in the enemy's deck. Excellent. No, it's a bless. A, 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 a bless, bless, not a curse. Sorry. This is a bless. Yes. I'm putting it in the enemy's um, deck. Then I attack the thing at range 4. 4. four. 5. And ice is infused. Damn it, it has one so health left. So close. One stinking half left. Wait, no. That doesn't happen. No? No, no. Back that up. I didn't attack it. You didn't Because I used the it. heal. That was dumb. I'm not thinking. I didn't attack it. Oh, that's a bug. That was, that was a mistake. Sorry, that was a wrong. There. Is the bless still two. in their deck? You still healed yourself? Yes. This bless still went in their deck? Cool. I moved too. Sorry. I'm okay. mixing up my cards. That would be the end of your turn, and thus the end of this yes. round. And then I am going to attack it. I heal. Yeah, you heal too. You pick up your two cards. Go open the door, if you can. You'll no, when I, when I do a long rest, I have to choose one of these two cards to discard, and I'm done. Oh, then you're I done. one card Shoot. left. Okay, I was thinking you had one more go. Nope. Nope. Oh, well. Nope. Alright, I am going to attack three... Sleepy time. And burn this bottom well, card. So card. attack three. And here's the plus one I drew before. So I did four to it. Do four to the thing, please. And then I will long rest. Because that'll get me two health back. And all my stuff here. And then what am I getting rid of? Do I get rid of my heal six? Except that's a move to thirteen. <sighs> oh my one oh no, my loot one I want. So we want to keep that for sure. That's my only move four. That's my only move three. Stun might be useful. Oh, that's my only attack four. Alright, I lose that. Alright, we're gonna kill it and loot it in the same turn, hopefully. We're gonna attack three. The rapid fire. Ooh, man. Attack three plus zero should kill it. And then I loot one and strengthen myself. 
So I won't even bother putting a chest out there because you looted it. So it becomes a rubble rubble. Then it's the next round. One, two, three, four. So I'm going to move four. I'm going at 26 because it's going to matter now. Oh, these are gone. Clear these out. No more. All this list of rats. Yes. No more. None of you. Alright, let's move these to the middle. Alright, move four. At 26. Gets me to the door. Spawn all those baddies. You want them all? Not really. You could just... Optional now I'm going to attack four, range three, curse two, I don't know, which, do I try to kill one of the weak ones or one of the elites? Kill one of the elites. Well, oh, here, this is what they're doing. Oh, okay, good thing I'm finishing my turn first. Oh, yeah, you're going to go before them, so that's okay. Well, yeah. Phew. So, yeah, I, I don't know. I, I, one of the elites, that one. Four, five. Should have hit a non-elite. It would have killed it. What's the elite's number? Number six. Here's your number six. Yep. Then they move plus one. So the elites are going to move in first. So they're going to go here. And then the other two aren't going to move. Well, they only move two. Whoops. The elites only move one. And then they have a move plus one. So they're moving a total of two. So... One, one, two. Yeah, that guy gets one, there. One, two. Oh. I, <laughs> like, you what, know are you, what? what are you pointing out? No, we're fine. All right. If I do six damage, Can I can't lose this round. Can you just jump past them and yes. take it out? But I won't be able to loot it this turn. That's the problem. Trying to decide for short rest. At this point, I just need to move over there and hit it with a two. So, no, I won't short rest. Can you rest. make them attack each other? No. Well, I have so few cards, I don't know if I want to take no. a chance. Oh, and no. if they blow up next no. to me, it's going to hurt. No, no, I just need no. to hit the thing and ignore them. Okay. Is what you I'm just thinking. just need to live through it. So, I'm going at 13, so it's nice but, and quick. Mo, can I point out the puppy? What? what? No, you're fine. Go on. What? I was going to say you'd be better off if you had hands in your card to discard, but you can discard two from your discard pile if you need to. Um. Yeah. Okay, I'll short rest. That's what I was trying to decide is you having more I cards to anything. potentially ditch might be. Yeah, that's fine. <sighs> it's tense, guys. Yeah, it says it's about as close as it gets. I can't reach it. Oh no, there we go. Move three. That'll get me there. With jumping. With jumping. Okay. And do I just attack at two to make sure I go first? Or do I do that? No, I'm going to attack at four because that's mm -hmm. the best chance of actually killing it. All right, I have 36 is as quick as I can go. And they're at 74. So you're first. Oh, this could, that's a lot of damage. Move plus zero, they suffer a damage. Yeah, I know. That's going to kill six. Attack plus one, targetology is All right, enemies. so this is only a move three. I use my jump boots. When you get boots, when you get shoes, flying over everything. Okay. They're only tapped, actually. Um, yeah, so when you take that long rest, you'll get them back. I don't think I'm taking exactly. a long rest. Uh, and then I have an attack four. It's ranged, which isn't going to work, so it's a disadvantage. Oh. Well then, get that out of your deck. Damn it. So it's not going to happen. The All disadvantage right. didn't matter because you pulled the miss on the first one. That's true. Alright, so starting with Elite, number thing. Six. Six only has a move two, so it's only going to go here, but then unfortunately seven is going to get to me. Okay. Attack plus one, so he has advantage. He only has a move one. Because they're a move plus zero. Last time they had a well, move plus one, so they could go two. So he can't get he any can't closer. Get to you. And then he's going to go there. there You're you right. Go. And then. They each suffer one damage. 
What's number seven? And six. Six. That can't be right. Six has taken that much damage? It's the elite that you banged on last turn. Oh, and that's then not you were like, him. oh, I shouldn't have hit the elite. Three, four, three, four, six. Yeah, okay. I read something wrong. Okay. Then number three is going to attack me. Yes. So first it suffers a damage. Then it attacks me. Okay. Then the other one moves two, it can reach and attacks. It takes one damage. What number is that? Number ten. ten. <sighs> Three. Keep that two. I can't possibly get much closer. I only have two cards left. Alright. Unfortunately though I'm not going till fifty-eight. This could do it. No, I'm gonna die before though. First. So close. Okay. <sighs> the elites can't reach me so they don't move. That's excellent. But then both these other guys attack. Okay. Number three? Sure. Hits for one. It's an attack minus one, so he's doing one. Yeah. Number ten. Alright, still alive. Okay, if I draw really well, this will do it. So I am, oh, I can't loot first and strengthen myself because then I can't loot to pick up the thing. So here it is. It's an attack three poison. Attack three, if this is a times two, we win. Do four damage to the thing. And then I loot, which doesn't do anything. And I strengthen myself. Can I have a strengthen, please? Yep. And then I short rest. Yep, that can go. <sighs> okay. If they go slower than 38, we win. Maybe. 52. Here it is. It's an attack 4. Range 3 curse. I missed. You pulled your miss. Oh my goodness. We lose. It came down to 1. Like, this is the only thing in there that you could draw that we would lose, and yep. you drew it. And then I loot. Wow. Oh. Wow. Holy. Uh, if I'm still alive, there's a very, very small chance, but go ahead. Infinitesimally small. The rat monstrosities are... Same thing. They attack at two. Okay. Or they're attacking at four. It's an attack plus one. The elites can't get in. They're attacking at three. It's an attack three from number three. Yes. And he takes one damage. Yes, if this attack is, he takes the damage. Not that it matters. Number 10 is attacking with a plus one. So that would be four. Still alive. Oh my gosh. One health left. This needs to be shuffled. A short rest. This also needs to be shuffled. And your deck needs to be shuffled. Did you do that miss? Yep. There's the time to do was on the bottom. The very flippant bottom. All you had to do was draw and not miss. I don't know. Anything. Well, no, I had to do at least two. But. Wait a minute. You were strengthened. Which means you draw two cards? Yes. We won. No, no, you drew, you drew. That was after? I was strengthened from the previous turn's loot. Yes, you were, but I just, I thought you drew two cards anyways. What was the other one up from then? What was that it was minus a minus one? one. Yeah, what was it there from? From that draw. I didn't draw the strengthen. Okay, but you drew a miss on that hit. Yes. And it was from the previous one. Okay, I get what you're saying. So it would have been a plus one and you would have hit it. We would have hit it. And you would have done it. And then we would have done you it. Were strength. We won. So we should have won. We but, won. But we owe another dollar to the jar because we're retconning things yet again. Okay. So you're So strength here, in. attack three, make that four, kills it, and yes. then I loot. And then you loot. So you're strength, done. Your strength and actually save the day. Yes. We. Done. Boom.
This was for the next round. Yeah. Okay. Done. Took care of it. It's all good. Holy. Here you go. That was to the wire. Holy cow, wow. is that ever to the Told wire? Told you I'd clean it up. Whee! All right, then. Um, the finale. Couldn't get any closer than that. The conclusion to Den of Thieves. It is rough work destroying these nests while <laughs> no being crap. attacked on all sides. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it is. Given the presence of the deformed rats, it is pretty clear there are some connections between the Vermlings and the Blood Cult, but you fail to locate any additional evidence. Ah. All you find for your effort is an interesting ring that could be of some value. With the infection eradicated, you make your exit. The reward is we gain item 31, Ring of Strength. And that's it. Nothing is open wow. or anything else. We didn't unlock anything. Yeah, we got a reward. Maybe it strengthens, which yeah. apparently is useful. Yes. We've learned that today. Item 31? Item 31. The Ring of Strength. Yep. <laughs> it strengthens. That is kind of... There's some irony there. There is. There wow, is some irony there. Wow, actually, let's keep all there. this money. Honestly, I don't know how often I would want a ring of strength. And no, probably, I do just you want a ring of strength. Probably. Where does it go? What, what it's slot item. does it take up? So here, it's also worth twenty bucks if you sold it. Mm -hmm. but yeah, I'll take it. We'll see. What I think do you can it. actually use it, right? Uh, as soon as I like hit, you have a slot. As soon as I hit level five, I'll have a slot. I do not have a slot at the moment. I'm using two items. Oh, well, did I come in with three items? I might have screwed up. What do I have for items? I don't know. You had a flea bit and shawl, I know that. No, like the like usable items. No, I only had two. I had a mana potion and a yeah. stamina potion. And like, I have two, a mana potion and a stamina potion. No, but no, at level did. five, I would be able to have a third one. And hence, I would be I was thinking strength. I screwed that up. Which... Man, that was close. That Holy was ridiculously close. Cow. Alright. Alright, so, um... The, no gold, the no. normal XP for this would be 8, eight because of the level, right? I'll double check, but I think it's 8. I don't remember where that is. I hate trying to find this every time. This should be on the back of the dang instruction book. Scenario level 2, 8, and golds are worth 3 each. I did not hit level 5. 12. Can you get me a pencil, please? Eight, nine, two, fifteen. Twenty-two, and I earned only seven. Seven plus eight is fifteen. Yes. Four, two, twenty-four. I am at two o seven, which means next time I'll definitely so become. I am not five. level five. You get to open the very exciting. Do not yes. open until level five package. I did not earn my perk. No, I did not earn my perk. Mine my was perk. mine was don't use as a standard. Like, don't ever use it as a, a, a two attack or two move. Oh, either way? Yeah. Oh, okay. Which I thought was really cool, but that wasn't going to happen. Never long rest. I yeah. could have, but... I don't even know where I put mine. I honestly thought getting this stuff back was... All right. So what do we... Do we want to move the camera now for leveling up or do that here? So we can show the stickers wait, better here wait. and stuff. Do you level up now and then we do our... We have to do a city. Yeah, events. I know. It's all the same thing. It's all back in Gloomhaven. Right. I think we might as well move the camera now. Well, that's what I'm trying to say. The city event, we can show there the stickers. There are no stickers. There are no stickers. That's all I'm trying to figure out is if people want to watch from there or watch us clean up. Like, mm -hmm. I could do the city event from here. Okay. There's a saying. Um, mess with the sleeping lion and you'll get the jaws. Whoops. Today, one of those days where you earn that drink discount. You knock on the door of Zane, an orchid. You knock on the door... Of Zane, an orchid who switched from providing assurances to providing excuses. He opens up and you let him know it's time to settle his tab. Come on, he sent the jaws? Right, okay. Problem is, you're a day early. I've got lots of gold coming my way. Huge haul on some bets. Guaranteed money. You notice some packed bags inside the doorway. Zane speaks up. Well, that's nothing. But just my plan B. No big deal. Don't need that anymore. I'm rolling in cash. Or at least I will be tomorrow. Heck, I'll even be willing to toss you something for the delay. Not buying it, he pays up now, or a little trust goes a long way. Come back tomorrow. 
I'm not buying it, are you? I could go either way. Yeah. Not buying it? What 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 manner of creature is he? He's an orchid. The weird little bee things. Nah, I don't feel particularly positive towards them. Okay. Not buying it? Not buying it. You shake Zane down for whatever you've got on him. He whines about not having the gold, but you gather enough to pay most of his debt. To make up the difference, you help yourself to a trinket on your way out. Might be useful. You could just pawn it for drinking money. We gained an item. Oh, man, the other one's even nicer, though. Oh, well. Item, I don't know. Item number 26. We'll find out. Oh, we should have showed off the ring to the stream. Oh, yes, my lovely ring. Would you like to see it? Ring of strength. Oh, there are two of these. Oh, you might like yeah, this. Yeah, see, the chat room said they're not buying it. <laughs> During your turn, perform a bless range 5 action. Eh. I can't see taking that versus other stuff. Okay, come on. Mr. Focus. Right? I mean, I guess if you if you just had a spot and you didn't know what else to do with it, However, you could sell it back to the uh, thing for well, 15 Well, you have three gold, items. Too. I could take it You for take now. it for now. If nothing else, you can always sell it for money. Yeah, which we should do Speaking right now. Speaking of which, how much are, are coins worth? Three worth? each. Is it only three? I thought it was yeah, four. Well, that three sucks. each. Three each. Three each. So no new maps to put out. So at this point, I need to level up. So I am going to do that. Please bear with me before we get to our I've final box. Excellent. So one of the things I'm going to do is we get to open this. This is a this big is alt pack, which I don't think is going to have anything interesting in it except for cards going up higher levels. I don't know. I wonder if maybe... No, they're just cards going up higher levels. Yeah. I was really hoping. I don't know why they put them separate. Oh, there's only one level five. I'm stuck with that one. How weird. That Every weird. other level in Gloomhaven, you, you get two. No level five, you. you get this card. Hmm. Green. Stand fast. Place the ward in an adjacent empty hex. It's considered an obstacle for all purposes. All enemies that enter a hex adjacent to the ward gain poison. All enemies gain disadvantage on all their attacks not granted by, not granted by you within range three of the ward. It infuses green, gets me 2 XP, and stays out for the rest of the game. That's very World of Warcraft um, Shaman. So all it is was higher level cards? There's nothing else yeah, in there? Yeah, there's nothing else I in there. I was hoping we were going to unlock the ability to uh, upgrade our cards. No, there'd be stickers somewhere then. Oh, that's true. You know what? They have little dots on them, but yeah, I guess it's only if them. you bring them into a Or, this one's pretty awesome. The bottom, one ally within range 3 can perform an attack 3 range 3 targeting the enemy of my choice. And it doesn't hurt you. To be fair, there could have been stickers in that packet. Oh, I guess. All right, the bottom's awesome. The top, that's weird. Yeah, Throw it's weird that you don't get to pick one. Yes, that's really odd. Like, that grow almost feels like a typo. Why is there no two fives? I can grow a tree. I don't know if I'll ever Welcome want to grow to a tree. Welcome to level five. You can grow a tree. And then use the, the great oak blessing on it. Yeah, it's true. They go together. All right, there's my level. That was a quick one. Here is my, my shiny new most text I've ever seen on a Gloomhaven card card. That's that's the ridiculous grow a tree. But then this bottom is going to probably make it put in my deck all the time. It's instead of my move, give you an attack at range 3. Attack 3, too. Like, that's a big <laughs> number. That goes here. Uh, these stay over here. I'm not going to clean up until we move this. Do we have any? I have to pick a perk. Let me look at my perks. Level up, get a perk. Oh, I'm thinking remove two minus one cards. It's starting to feel like after that last one. Well, you don't get to remove the miss, so. Or the add plus one and heal, because that gets rid of poison. Right? That's... I don't know. You haven't seen my deck enough to really know, right? Oh, here. Replace one minus one. Mm -hmm. With a plus zero heal one ally. I would totally do that. I think that, that works. That, that kind of does a bit of both of what I was... Gets rid of one. I always try and get the negative stuff out of my deck as quick as so possible. So there, I get this plus one ally, which that's an interesting looking. And that goes bye byes
Wow. Well, we're we're uh, starting extra life on an epic note. I feel. Yeah. By having pulled that off at the last possible instant in the most dramatic way possible. If we hadn't retconned it, it would have been slightly slightly better. But. Well, yeah, we had to retcon a bit, but. Okay. You figured it out before we cleaned it up. Yes, I did. Okay, this is the deck of shopping. Again, I'm trying not to clean up, but I just want stuff out of my way. Yeah, you do whatever. It's just while well, you're doing your whatever, I think right. you might as well clean. We'll do some final thoughts. You can kill that. Okay. We, uh... All right, there we go. To the wire. That was about as close as you can get in Gloomhaven. Um, that was an interesting match. I did not think my character would be able to survive the rest of that. Getting it so that only the uh, weak ones could attack me worked out really well. I don't know, your thoughts? I thought we were going to be talking about what we could do better next time. But that didn't I'm in end shock up the case. that we pulled it off. Yeah. I'm still in shock that we pulled it off. Yes. That, that was a tough scenario. That was, that was not easy. I, I, I'm tempted to at some point go and Google... Uh, Gloomhaven Jaws of the Lion scenario 19 and see how many people are talking and complaining about this one. See how other people feel about it. See yeah. how other people feel, yes. So yeah, really interesting scenario where we had to destroy objectives and there were tons of bad guys. Some with tons of health. These rat monstrosities are terrible. With five health and when they kill them, they blow up. And the that elites was have eight health and when you kill them, they blow up they for blow two. Up. They always have advantage for um, as usual. Those raiders had 14 health. Yeah, like, the like Vermling the raiders. Raiders, that was insane. Yeah, tough Vermlings. I'm not used to that. No, no, I was shocked by the tough Vermlings. Tough Vermlings. Neither of us got our battle goals. <laughs> That's par for the course for me. Yeah. I don't uh, know how I'm feeling about that shield thing. I think it worked, but then I ran out of cards. Yeah, you're running out of cards. But you had to run out of cards from taking damage. So obviously you didn't, if you had had less shield, that would have happened earlier. Well, at the end, it was some. There were some bad pulls, yeah. and I had to burn a bunch of cards, and that is why, in the end. But also, that shield made one card be locked in up here, so that's one card out. I burned. I burned that one that made me give have shield three far too early. I yeah. thought more people were going to get at me. If I'd had that for the final mm -hmm. room, that would have been beautiful. I should have. Originally, my thought was to save it to get into here, and I should have stuck with it. I don't know. I'll try it again next time, maybe. All right, what I screwed up bad was using that card at the beginning of the game that was going to let me curse any time there was an enemy within two, and I got one curse out of it, and it could have been five. You really should have waited, waited till we were in here. here, or here. Yeah. So that was the biggest mistake. And then there was the reading that one card wrong, mm -hmm. where I messed up and was going to give you an attack four, and I wasn't even adjacent to you. So that was just... Yeah. I don't think I made any grievous errors. I, I, I feel like I should have saved that shield three for... I think it's a shield three. I should that burn card shield three for I should have saved it for in here. Anyway, I don't know. I'm surprised. I didn't think we were gonna get through that one. Got a pretty cool ring, but that's it. I was hoping for a bigger reward. I guess that's neat. Strength. It's neat. We got an item that wouldn't got have been unlocked otherwise, right? It's just a single use. If that was a, every every long rest it'd be cooler. But yeah, we did unlock something cool. Plus again, a new rule. We had to destroy obstacles and loot them. That hadn't happened before, so that's kinda interesting. Again, each scenario has been unique. I think they really pulled out stops to make a bunch of unique scenarios in here. So next time we play, which should be on Friday, 9 p.m. Eastern, join us at twitch.tv slash tabletop bellhop. We're again going to have two choices. So we're going to do number 20, oh, which is somewhere over here, which is misplaced goods, which is another side quest, which is kind of what I'd like to do. Or we're going to continue the main quest and do the vile harvest, which is over here. What we do need is a permanent marker to mark that we have completed the Den of Thieves. Which did not actually make us cancel anything else out. So Den of Thieves is Because it was a side quest. That was a side quest. We guessed it was going to be a side quest and we were right. Yes. So the other thing today I have to mention before we go is we are gaming for Extra Life today. That is a worldwide uh, charity effort for the Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. Um, we are going to be gaming until 11 a.m. tomorrow. This was our first game of our event, and we would love your support. You can do that a couple ways. If you're here live on Twitch, if you're on desktop, just scroll down. You'll see a widget that has a donate button on it. Uh, if you're on mobile device watching us, you just got to turn it sideways to see the stream sideways. There'll be a little button that shows a jigsaw puzzle. That'll show all of our um, plugins, and you just got to find the Extra Life one. What I think is way easier is just go to WindsorExtraLife.com. 
W-I-N-D-S-O-R-E-X-T-R-A-L-I-F-E, all one word, dot com. And there's lots of places there where you can click to donate. We would greatly appreciate your support. Uh, we are current, the two of us are playing for uh, Sick Kids in Toronto, yep. Ontario. 100% of your donation goes to the charity. We see none of that. And even the extra light people don't take anything out of that. What they do is they uh, encourage people to sign up for platinum badges so they can mm, earn stuff. There's no stuff. processing fees. There's right no now. processing fees, nothing. And if you spend at least $10, you should get a tax receipt from Sick Kids. Yeah. Though it might take a while to show up, so don't you worry. You won't get it until the new year. Yeah. yeah. It usually shows up like the end of February, beginning of March. All right. Uh, what else we got? On um, you uh, on that thing, YouTube, there should be a button up here with an eye on it. That'll lead to the rest of our stuff. The thing. It's up there. It's right over there. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm pointing in the right spot. Yeah, up there. Um, then we have, uh, I think that's about it. Yeah, you know, normally I'd, I'd be pumping the rest of our stuff, but nope. there's no reason for that it's today. Go to tabletopbellhop.com for the rest of our content. That's about it. It's extra life. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to kill the um, recorded video because we do release these on YouTube. If you're on YouTube, thanks. Good night and game on. Good night. <laughs> game on. For Tabletop Bellhop, I am Mo Tuzno, the Tabletop Bellhop. And I'm Deanna. Good night and game on.